Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. Happy Friday. Happy Freaky Friday. Are you guys excited? I want to hear and see that you guys are excited. Spam some emotes in the chat. Today we are doing a very special and exciting stream. So you already know what the title is. We're doing some scorched earth today. But before that, we have something even more exciting to know. Um, and it's the things behind me. I spent all week preparing for a community event that I scheduled. And this is our first community event of the server. It took me a while to get to do one, but we're finally at it now. I am hosting a Dodo beauty pageant. That's how I want to kick off the stream. And uh, we're going to be doing this real quick before we go to Scorched Earth because I want to get this out of the way. Said that I would do it on Friday. And uh, yeah, it's basically we're going to have a first place winner and a second place winner. And there's some cool prizes to, to give out. Y'all will see those as soon as we rate people's dodos. But this event takes place at the community center that I built up. Y'all saw that in the last stream. And I am the queen judge of the dodos. I have my own dodo that I bred too. So if y'all didn't know, me and Jimmer have made a tribe alliance and we've been working together. So let me go ahead and show you around my little, <laughs> the dodo farm. These are, this is the latest batch. There's a lot of dodos here, okay? And uh, these are our really good ones over here. Literally have been at this for a week. So people have been so excited to show me off or show off their dodos to me. And uh, I'm, super, I'm super excited to judge them. I'm trying to spare them a little bit of time. We had to delay the stream a little bit because Ark decided to update. So that was fine. Let me step back so we have better view. She looks so weird right now. <laughs> but yeah, Ark decided to do a little update at 8 o'clock at night. So we had to push back the stream a little bit. Not fun. But before we get started... I have a little message to say. I, uh, I'm very happy about the Scorched Earth servers. So I, I really wanted to do the, the stream the day it released, but I was super busy setting up something super important, which I, I hope that you guys took a look at the community tab and my other socials because I already announced it there. We're launching a Scorched Earth server along with having our island server. And <clears throat> I just... I really want to like say a special thank you to each and every one of you guys who support the channel in any way. I just, I appreciate every, every one of y'all, whether you've been here with us since the beginning or you've recently joined, uh, your presence just make the, makes this community really special. Every like, every comment, any interaction that you guys provide, it fuels my passion for creating like more and more content every day, especially the art content. I know y'all, y'all love the art content and it, it means a lot to me. Uh, the art community as a whole has really surprised me in the best of ways. And I <laughs> look at Jimmer in the back and I just I appreciate it. I appreciate all the tips and the backseat gaming. I love backseat gaming, as you all know. It's been so helpful and I want to extend like a, a very special thank you to those of you have, who have gone above and beyond to support the channel through like super chats and memberships. Uh, your generosity has gone a very, very long ways. We have two servers now. I have an editor, as y'all know. So, you know, the funds that y'all provide, they go to paying him. And uh, YouTube may be like a passion for me, but it's also a job. So <laughs> the... Uh, the little donations that y'all provide help out a lot with that, allowing me to create more and more content. So it makes a real difference. Everything that y'all do, it allows me to create more content that entertains y'all and, you know, do other amazingly cool things like Scorched Earth servers. But uh, enough ushy gushiness. Enough ushy gushiness. We're going to go ahead and uh, head off to the community center. 
Aw, <laughs> Sierra. I'm poor, but we love you, Freaky. I appreciate the super chat. Um, and Kennedy, thank you so much for the super chat as well. I, Y'all help out a lot. Y'all really do. All the memberships, I put... I, I try to put a majority of the donations and uh, super chats and all that good goodness that y'all provide towards making the channel better. Um, I don't use much of it for myself. But, uh, yeah. Are y'all ready? We're gonna go. We're gonna go to the community center now. <laughs> no more, no more ushy gushy. That's like a special occurrence, okay? <laughs> Okay. And Jimmer was able to get on the server. Jimmer, I stole your bird for you. It, it's raining. It's raining on our special day. Oh, no. Not good, not good. And what's the hour? 1922. Okay. Time to leave the wet and cold island and go into the hot and dry. I also want to bring up another point. Um, so I don't know if any of you guys have noticed, but I don't have as much enthusiasm for the island as in the last series. Honestly, it's a pretty um, lackluster map. Once you've played it, you know, a couple of times starting fresh more than twice, I would say it gets a little boring. And uh, if y'all have noticed that my enthusiasm has gone down a little bit, it's because the the island has gotten a little boring for me. I I watched a couple streams, not not much, and I didn't learn anything about Scorched Earth, so it's completely blind. I watched uh, some streams in my Discord, people trying out Scorched Earth single player, just to like see what the map looks like and uh, you know look at a couple different aspects. But uh, as soon as I saw Scorched Earth, I was like, oh, my God, this is what I want the island to be like. I want there to be harsh weather effects. I want it to be a more difficult game to have more of a like an arc experience because the island's really easy and it's honestly not the prettiest. I'm going to say it now. I don't like the island that much. It's boring. It's not pretty. I think that Scorched Earth is prettier than the island. And uh, I don't even like desert scenes. I, I don't know why. I don't know why I like it so much. But I saw that environment and I was like, put me in it right now. And I've already decided that we are doing a, uh, a Western themed community center. It's going to be like cowboys, cowgirl themed and, you know, like Western saloons. It's going to be great. Hopefully. Y'all know I'm not the best builder. But uh with that being said, it does not mean that we are ending the island um, series. We still have to continue that. But I think as far as that goes, we're going to continue to do it how we've been doing it. And I kind of want to get to the bosses sooner rather than later. But from this point onwards, I think we're going to be doing one island stream a week and one Scorched Earth stream a week at least. Because I want to, you know, put a kickstart on the on the server. <laughs> it's going to be fun. It's going to be so fun. And another thing that I'm super excited for as far as Scorched Earth goes is that you need to have a team with you. It's a very hard map. And I am truly thrilled to see how people are going to work together to get through these harsh elements and uh, the danger dinos and all the hardships that come with Scorched Earth. Me and Jim are already teaming up. Don't ask him if he, he even wants to be on a team with me. I just, you know, duct tape over the mouth. He shook his head yes, okay? <laughs> but we're teaming up. He's probably happy about it, okay? He's probably happy about it. And uh, I'm excited for that. I really love interacting with the community. I try to play as many games that involve the community as possible. And I feel like Scorched Earth is really going to be fun when it comes to that. Do I need stamina? No, my bird is awesome. <laughs> you volunteered him? I sure dang did. Sure dang diddly did. 
Are you transferring your character to Scorched Earth? At the moment, uh, you can't do that. So we are starting fresh and um, we are not letting any of the community on the Scorched Earth server until the end of stream. So that means I will be doing the entire start of the series alone, <laughs> alone, which is going to be uh, a little scary, a little scary, but I'm excited. Um, we'll talk more about that when we get to Scorched Earth as far as what steps we're going to take to make progress. I honestly don't know. So I hope that you guys are there to give me bunches of tips and tricks. I never played Scorched Earth on even Evolved, so I'm going to appreciate the help a lot. Um, I know nothing about elements because as y'all can see, we don't really have much going on on the island to where I'd have to worry about it. But, um, yeah, we're staying on the island for a, a while's longer. So if you guys haven't already and you're looking for a great community to join as far as like playing on ARK and making friends, now is the best time ever to do so. And for our server, it is a, mem a members only server. You can... Uh, get access to it by hitting the little join button on my channel page and being a super freak tier higher. But now is the best time to join. We have this island server going. It's going to be going for a while. Y'all know how slow I am with things. It's going to take a while for me to end this island. Um, and now we have the brand new Scorched Earth, Earth server. Earth. <laughs> so uh, if you do want to join the server, you know how to join the discord afterwards that's how you gain access and uh i hope to see y'all there and we have more community events coming and this is just one of many with this little dodo pageant okay so we're here we got some people waiting for me to judge i do hate that it's gonna be nighttime soon i really do so we're not staying on the island for too long. We're going to be starting Scorched Earth in, a, in like 20 minutes, okay? It's not going to take me long to do this. Um, what I'm going to do, uh, so, it's <laughs> so it's not too dark when I'm judging, is let me switch over. Let me, let me switch over to my Be Right Back screen so I can go into admin mode, change the time real quick, and... Uh, We'll have bright lighting. So give me one second. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I forgot to unmute. Here, we'll we'll start again, okay? We'll start again. Basically, basically. We're back. Hello. It's bright now, and uh, I've thrown out my dodo. And let me tell you, breeding for colors takes a very long time. It is grindy and it takes forever. Um this is what I got done. This is my little Dodie I've been working on. It's pink and purple on the head, and it's got a black face and black feet. What I was aiming for 
is basically this, but the wings have like a cute blue color on them, about the same color as this cryopod. And uh, couldn't get there in time, but this is what we got. The freakiest dodo of the server. She pretty, she cool. She is not in the competition. I just wanted to do this for fun so I could learn how to breed um, better for Ark. Breeding is a pretty important part, as I've heard. But uh, let's go ahead and throw out some other doties. I have Jimmers with me. Jimmer, this is the one you want to use, right? Look at everyone. Jimmer, if I drop this, can you throw it down and it won't have cryo sickness? I'm going to drop it for you. Here you go. You drop your own doty. I'm excited. I'm so excited. Needs more purple coloring. <laughs> oh, see, look, that's what we got Jimmers for. So this is our first contestant. Jimmer, not a very creative name. We're going to take some points off for that. Um, if you would like to give it a name, you, you still can. Hmm. I like the blue face. I like the, uh, what is that even called? Like the, the mix of the blue and the black on the feet. That's very nice. Very nice. Got a purple base with the blue tipped wings. Good bird. Good bird. Next. Where is it? Don't move your bird onto the winner stand. I, I had to build this ladder. Pickles, you butt chicken. <laughs> so we have we have our next contestant. And this is Dodo J. Trump. Um you know, I honestly feel like this is a nice uh a nice looking bird. <laughs> This whatever I say this moment going forward um, has no um, my political stance is nothing about what I say going forward. OK, nothing, nothing. I'm just looking at the bird colors. OK, <laughs> I like the orange face <laughs> and um, Dodo Trump's hair really, really matches um, what we all picture in our head. <laughs> It's very nice. And we also have the uh, the black and the orange mix on the feet. It's it's a great bird, though. I'm going to take it and yeet it. It's not ready to be on first place yet. We have to look at the other birds. OK, <laughs> got to look at the other birds. OK, what else we got in here? <laughs> let me let me get over here. <laughs> there we go. Don't ask me how I built that. I just did it. OK, what is this one? This is a little Gertie's bird or uh, bird. I really like this one. I like how vibrant it is. So the face blinding, blinding. It is so green. I love that. We got the, the purple and the yellow contrast on the wings really makes it pop. This is one of my favorites so far. I really like this one. What else we got? What else? Oh, another dodo. <laughs> you can just you can just eat it in here, sir. <laughs> what is this? I want to look at this one. Alice Claymore's Claymore's is a blue jammer, right? That's your tribe. We got the purple and the green. I like the whole Hulk look. Did you name yours? Oh, his name was Little Gertie. What is this one? Alice? I want to know the meaning of the word Alice. I love the purple and the green. There's no other colors. It's pretty straightforward. Very nice. I would have loved I would have loved to see the tip of the nose be a black or something. But, um, you know, maybe there's a reason why you left it blank. That's just my little critique. It looks great. This is probably my second favorite one. I just I like the vibrant colors a lot. You know, I'm honestly surprised that we didn't see too much pink and blue. This one is. Catches bird. <laughs> it's the uh, the singer pink. OK, OK. We got some red on the wings. Does she wear like red lipstick? I'm not too sure. OK. 
okay. I like the purplish head, the bluish purplish head. She's got some pink toes, okay. I do like me some pink toes. Very cute, very cute. Yes, I would love to know the uh, the inspiration behind the, the pink singer dodo. I don't know too much about pink. Um, that was a, a 2010 center singer, right? I kind of grew up with her. I just don't know what she looks like. Well, let me see what else we got, what else? This is Steve from the Peaky Blinders. And this is uh, our newest member, Kennedy's Bird. Kennedy, I really like it. I love the, the mixture of blues and the pink on the wing. You know, you know, my channel colors. And uh, there's a little bit of pink on the tail as well. Anyone else have their little bird? We got a white dodie right here. <laughs> I think this is one that me and Jim are kind of bred together. I don't know if this is someone's uh, contestant. Do we have any more? Any more dodies that I'm missing? I think I got jammers. We got the Trump bird. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the one that we bred together. And if y'all were wondering, this is the uh, the Dodo basketball mascot. This is not a contestant either. This is one that I made up because, as you can see, we have some Dodo basketball um, baskets on the back of the community center. And that's what this bird is for. It's pretty cool. Let me take it out. We're gonna push it over here. So, I'm gonna go, whose bird is this? <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and select the winner in second place. <laughs> she, hashtag she hulk dodo I meant. Yeah, hashtag she dodo, <laughs> dodo hulk. I'm gonna start with second place. Don't you be shooting no one's birds. We're gonna start with second place, okay? And I think we're gonna go with, let me get back in here. I should take this off so I can walk in here better. There we go, that's much better. Uh, everyone put your favorites in chat cause I know who I'm gonna pick, but I wanna know who's, who's were y'all's favorites. And don't say mine, I know mine is so, so beautiful, <laughs> but it is not a contestant, only co the contestant birds. I think, hmm, 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 we're going to go with the Claymores for the second place. How do I pick up your dodo? Y'all and claim your dodies. I got to put them on second place or you guys can. If you're here in the crowd, Jammer, put your put your Dodie in the second place. Yeah, everyone say yay, Jammer. Woo! Blue, blue Jammer. Woo! <laughs> Trump for the win. Oh, my God. And Blue Jammer, we appreciate your... Uh, your time and effort for this community challenge. <laughs> I know, I know, it's a, it's a hard pin to put your dodi in. I appreciate you taking the time to breed out this wonderful dodo. Second place, Jammer, look at that. Let me go ahead and drop your prizes on the floor. So for second place, we decided I would be giving out a full thing of dodo clothing. And there you go. Put on the clothing, Jammer. Let us see it. Let us see it. I really loved your dodo. The, the green and the purple contrast. Very nice. Very nice. And uh, another thing while we are waiting for the first place winner to take their rightful crown. Don't forget to smash the like button, guys. If you are finding this entertaining let me know by smashing that like button uh it really helps a lot and uh, if you're watching this after the stream has concluded let me know in the comments what you think of this if you want to see more community events on the streams i would really appreciate it look at that that's a nice looking shirt let's see them pants oh 
Dumpy Dumpy, look, Dumpy alert with the dodo pie. Oh my God. Jammer is cheeked up. Jammer is cheeked up. So, y'all ready? We're gonna be picking first place winner. And I'm gonna say right now, Lil Trumpy, he's pretty good. We're gonna put him in front of the podium. And I think our other contender, contender for uh, first place is Gertie. I can't move Gertie's bird, though. I should have had... I should have told people to, to unclaim it. I don't know how to move it. <laughs> so it's between little Gertie and the Dodo Trump. I, uh, I see a lot of people in the comments. They really, they really like Dodo Trump. <laughs> <laughs> Jammer has a shelf. He really do. A lot of junk in the trunk. <laughs> I'm, I'm so conflicted on who to choose. I think that this one is so creative as far as the name goes and like what it is as a dodo. <laughs> but I really just love the colors of this one. It's so vibrant. I think, I think Dodo Trump is a um an honorable bird he would definitely be third place for me but we are giving that win to little gertie bird look at that beautiful beautiful bird gertie i know you're not here right now with us but uh as soon as i get back in contact with you we will put your your little birdie in first place and give you your prize. If y'all did not know, first prize, I'll keep it warm for you, okay? First pl prize is this winner winner dodo, chibi dodo. We're gonna equip it. Y'all can take a look at it. First place winner gets the uh, the dodo chibi. And it's, it's a cute one, okay? Let me see if I can go into photo mode. Trump loses again. Oh my God. This has nothing to do with my political standing. I will say that again. Look at this cute little Dodie though. Congrats. Congrats for first place. You made a good one. You made a really good Dodo. I, I loved it. I loved it. It was stolen. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. But there we go. Very fun community event. I appreciate you all for joining and taking the time to breed out these doties. And I hope you join us again for the next community event. I hope that we have even more contestants for the next community event. Um, this was fun. This was so good. The hay is real. Pickles, you got third place. You got third place. Uh uh. Make a cage for Trump here. Yeah, we'll make a little cage. We'll put him. We'll put him in the in the dodo basketball cage. I'll lock him up over here because I don't have a cage on me. <laughs> oh, crap. <laughs> I am. I'm so bad at dodo basketball. That might be our next community challenge. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lordy. <laughs> Um, I will not compete in the Dodo basketball. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Embarrassing. Um, let me try for this one. <laughs> ah, hmm. Um, you would have thought that I had a lot of practice with this in the first series, but, uh, not really. Um. Hmm. I'm gonna try one more time, okay? We get we get one more try. If not, I have a new plan. Perfect, literally perfect. That's what I meant to do. That's actually what I meant to do. I promise. What happens if the dodo goes in the water? Um, it becomes shark food. <laughs> there we go. Dodo Trump will stay on the dodo basketball cage. Very nice. Very nicely done. Great. <laughs> Yay. So that was our first community event. I am going to go ahead and go into the hype house and kind of wrap it up in there. And then we're going to head over to some scorched earth. Then she'd have to go into the water and get it. Now we got five more episodes for that. 
This is my little admin room for the community center. It only has generators in it. There's nothing special in here. But yeah, this is where I log off. There we go. <laughs> that was very fun. Very, very fun. Mm -mm -mm. So, are y'all ready for Scorched Earth? Let me, let me see what they wrote about Scorched Earth. Oh, ooh, mute the, the YouTube. So it says that stranded, naked, dehydrated, and starving in a vast desert, even the most seasoned ARC survivors must quickly find water, hunt for food, harvest and craft items, and build shelter to have any chance for survival. Uh, use skills honed on Earth's faraway island to kill, tame, and breed and ride the fantastical new creatures that have evolved to survive the desert's ultra-harsh conditions, including dragons. Ay ay ay. Uh, Doomed Ark does not allow us to cluster the servers together yet, sadly. So, at the moment, we have uh, two separate servers. As soon as we're able to cluster servers together, I wheel. Oh my goodness. I, I'm scared. Terrified. I went through the process of testing this server today. I hope it lets me respawn with a new character. <sighs> scared. Very scared. Again, at the end of stream, I will be making this, uh, the Scorched Earth server, yeah, Scorched Earth server, um, public to my members. So stay in tune for that. It's gonna be great. How do I make a new character? Is it gonna ask me? Cause I don't wanna be the character I was using for testing. <laughs> Yeah, there we go. Create new survivor. So I think that we are going to spawn either right here or right here. So Midlands 4 or South 3. <laughs> Password is 12345, by the way. <laughs> no, it's 123456. <laughs> okay, I am going to pick... Let's go with South 3. That seems like a good one. It's green. We're going to try our, our best at the South 3 spine. Create new survivor. You know, we go on with our OG freaky creation. I did make her boobs a little bigger because, you know, it helps with thumbnails. But uh, yeah, flat as a board. Hashtag itty bitty titty committee. But we got the big dumpy. We got the big dumpy. That is not fake. Big dumpy. Y'all ready? This is pretty little freak. And she's about to die in the desert. Create. And right here. And spawn. Yes. Ooh. It's a little quiet. Very quiet. <laughs> okay, well, here we are in the desert. We have spawned in. Let's see where we are on the map. Oh, we spawned right where it said we would. Um, yeah, I don't really know what we're supposed to do first. So basic, basic steps of survival, basic ne necessities is water, food, shelter, right? Those are the three basics. There are a bunch of crazy things over here. Um, I say we try and find. I don't know. I don't know. Survive. We have to survive. We got to find a good spot. I say we try and find a good spot, like a flat land. Not too many predators so we can build a shack. And live in said sh shack. <laughs> Ooh, there's a lot of Carnos here. Hmm. Oh, what is that? That's a horse. Oh, remember, remember in the island series, our, our newest one, when the unicorn attacked us? The only server unicorn attacked us? 
Nothing's attacking us thus far. I expected, like, to spawn in a swarm of bugs. I kind of like this spot. What is that? What is that sound? Cactus sap works for hydration. Now is the time to start spamming in tips, guys. I hear something really cute, and I don't know what it is. It kind of sounds like Stitch from Lilo and Stitch. I want water. I want to be closer to water. Like, I want a little oasis. Give me an oasis. There's some grass here. Hmm. Grass. I don't see any predators. I want to turn up the volume. Why did the volume get so low? Music volume's at 20. We're going to turn that to 31, I guess. Maybe 40. Save. Is that better? It's just so quiet. <laughs> water jug bugs are good to keep an eye out for uh, if you're far away from water. How do they drop water for you, though? Does it say water sack and you, like, drink out of the sack bug? Hmm. <gasps> That's a nice little spot over there. Oh, but I gotta go through the water to get it. Are there piranhas? Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Maybe I can go around. Here, we'll try to go around first. I, I don't know what's in the water of scorched earth. <laughs> Probably nothing good. Yeah, I want to live like right there. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to do a run jump. Y'all know how to run jump? You run jump. Come on, make it halfway, halfway. I'll walk halfway. Oh, get out of there. Get, get, get. Disgusting. It's green. It's nasty looking. I would like to build here. What do y'all think about this spot? This looks cute. I like this. It's, it's good. So I guess to start off with, we'll collect some resources. <laughs> Just Megs and Sarko. I don't see none of that, sir. We got some wood. We got some thatch. Let's get some fiber. We got some berries. That's nice. <gasps> oh, there's something going on. Is this the sandstorm? Why is there lightning? <laughs> Should I stand behind a rock? Oh, Lord. See, way better than the island. You're never going to get this in the island. This is so cool looking. Oh my god, what do I do? Let me look through my, my enagrams. This is what we have so far. <laughs> um, what's that? Someone told me about a gerboa. And they kind of look like lemurs, I think. Hmm. I don't know, I'm gonna stay behind this rock. This rock looks good. <laughs> Let's go into our enagrams and start uh, unlocking some things. <laughs> May what is this frontier structure? Oh, this is all the DLC stuff, I think. Some of it. How do you get this ghillie clothing? Get cloth armor helps protect you from the heat. Maybe we should do the ghillie first, though, because this is one thatch. I don't have any enneagram points. We're going to have to do stuff. Oh, God. Oh, lordy. Well... Um... Can we, like, can we harvest these tumble... No, we cannot harvest the tumbleweeds. We're going to have to fight something to get some points. Um, that's scary. I don't know what that is. I'm going to stay away from that. It's going to be so hard to see. So, what's the point of the sandstorm? I'm very slow, but does it, like... It takes all of our stamina away. I guess it's putting, like, dirt in our lungs or something. What should I do f first to get some points? Is this kangaroo a passive tame? <laughs> I need something tamed. <laughs> hmm. Oh, what is that? Can I beat this? That's 108. Should I beat this? 
It's kind of cute. Spend the levels you already have? What should I use my levels on? We have six points available. And I guess that gives us some Enneagram points. Kill the bug. I'm gonna kill the bug. Wait, after I make something, can I make a spear or like some... What does the highest damage that we can make? 100% damage. Uh, this doesn't tell me anything. I'm gonna kill the heck out of that bug. Let me make one. Let me make one. We're gonna need... Spear? Can I unlock a spear? S-P-E-A-R. That's a level two thing, so let me go ahead and uh, level up. We're gonna put a point in... Uh... Let's put some in fortitude. Since this map is all about elements, why not put one in fortitude, you know? And let's make a spear. <gasps> we have the reusable spear. I should have learned that. We'll get that later. We'll, we'll get it later. I want to save my points. So we need two pieces of flint. What is that? Oh, little lystros. I can kill those. Should I kill the lystros? Let's make a little pickaxe. I need one piece of stone. Um, what is that? Y'all hear that? It's something sniffing around and then whining. That's water. I need one rock, game. Give me one rock. What is that sound? That's a jerboa? The thing's sniffing? Where is it? There's so many flowers and like rocks over here. <gasps> there it is. I have that. How do I get this? I want this. I need a rock though. Can I punch the rock? No. <gasps> there we go. Okay, we can make a, a, a pickaxe and a, a regular axe now. Let's see. Ooh, our crafting speed is so low. <laughs> okay, now give me a regular axe. Oh, it's called a hatchet. Oops. Do I have hatchet? No, I don't have hatchet. Stone hatchet. That seems great. Give me that. Crafting. I need one piece of flint. I guess I'll use my pickaxe. Look, now we'll get plenty of stone. There we go. Look at us. We're getting our basic tools. It's going well. Can I smack this jerboa with a with a club and then put berries in its butt? Is that how that works? Or is it a little meat eater? I don't should I punch it or should I make a club? I'm gonna make this hatchet. And sand, lots and lots of sand. Hmm. There's a perfect shelter in a small cave in one of those spires just down the river from where you are. What's a spire? What What is a spire? Just punch it, berries, berries and punch it. Okay, I have some berries. Let me put my tool away. Where is it at? Where are you at, buddy? Oh, it's in here now. Uh, are you hiding? Like, can you not hide in here? Where are you? <laughs> Dude, get out of the bushes. There. Okay, can you get out of the bushes, though? Because I might have to punch you. Come here. No. Ah, oh, dang it. It's gone. Oh, and now it rains. Uh, well, we'll find another one. We're gonna, we're gonna beat the heck out of this Lystro instead. <laughs> that thing's gone. <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't try to hunt near the water. <laughs> Craft one. I think I'm doing pretty good. Haven't died yet. <laughs> Knee deep water. It's gone. <laughs> That is not knee-deep water. That... No. 
Swimming animation, I'm out. Nope. <laughs> that is not knee-high water. Death. Ah, dang it. Please don't leave. Oh, no. Oh, I hate this. I'm doing it. I'm doing it, Mr. Krabs. Oh, I hate this. I hate this so much. There's probably piranhas just waiting. Did I? Give me the meat. G give me that meat. And we needed hide anyways. Oh. Oh, goodness. No, 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 no. No. Get me out of here. I don't know where the other one went. But look at that. We got some hide. And I think that means that we can make some cloth armor now. Ah. <sighs> Also, this slipped my mind. Wait, I don't know what I just did to the game. I, I broke it. One second. This slipped my mind. <gasps> I can't see it now. So earlier on the in uh, earlier on, before we started the stream, someone subscribed, and I wanted to make sure that I thanked them. I don't remember who it was, and I feel very bad now. What what happened to my game? <laughs> Graphics, video, vi video, not windowed, full screen. Thank you. Now I tried to scroll up in the chat to find it, and now I feel really bad. They either upgraded their membership or they started a membership. But thank you to whoever did that. If I forgot, my memory is so trash. Carlos, did I thank you? If not, I'm sorry, but I really appreciate you for, for uh, becoming a member. You're awesome. I got so excited. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, so we were looking up how to do some cloth armor. Is anyone's brain like that? That's a club. No, what am I typing? Is anyone else's brain like that? You'll go on like a huge tangent and then you'll be like, oh yeah, what did I have for breakfast again? Me. For anything. Any topic. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead. Oh yeah, this only requires fiber. I thought cloth required hide for some reason. Good enough for me. Plus we have some points. So what did y'all say? Put it into health, stamina, and fortitude. Right? Maybe some weight? I'll put some into weight. And then I'll put some into stamina, since we're going to be running from things, probably. Yes, my brain is chaos. It, it's just, it is how it is. I don't know. I've always been like that. I can't just, like... I, I, don't, I can't function with talking about multiple things. <laughs> Shoes need hide? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll go ahead and use my hide for the shoes. So... Look at us. We're getting our first bit of armor now. And you already know we're about to hide this hat. Dude, excuse me. What is that thing trying to trample me? I'm guessing it's nice. We got some stuff for our hands. We got torso, some feet, some pants. Look at that. And a little hattie. And then hide hat, because the hats in this game are ugly. It's a plant eater. More morella tops. That kind of sounds like a type of mushroom. Am I wrong? You sound like a, like a variation of mushrooms, man. Anyways. At Pretty Little Freak, do you have the survival bob pack? No, I'm waiting to learn more about it before I go purchasing anything. I know it comes with a train, but uh, that's about it. That's all I know. There's some Argies over there. Not that we're going to be getting an Argy anytime soon. <laughs> Tame them when they're when they're slow or they will attack instead of running away. There's another Jerbo over here. They're passive wood alone, but if others are around, they attack if you attack. If that makes sense. Oh, yeah, there's a bunch of tames like that. Bunch of little dinosaurs that do that. Where's this Jerboa that I'm hearing? He's a somewhere. 
Um, Spirit, you said down the river. You mean this way? I hope I'm going the right way. <gasps> uh, what? What is that? Oh, pay! <gasps> hey! Hey! Honey, Dumplin', what's up? How you doing? You want some berries? Here. My sweet child. Come here. You want some berries? You want some berries? Yeah? Look what we found, guys! Oh, uh, get out of that water. It's scary. Come on. Look what we found! It's gonna keep us company! Oh. Is it good now? Uh, I don't really have a lot of berries, man. Here, t you can take these narco berries. I really need to make a Peggy sticker. What is that? What is that? Oh, no! Ah! Oh my god! My piggies! Oh no! I thought that was a pig! I thought that was a pig in the water! It had the head of a pig! Oh no! Oh. I was so happy! Well, number one. Uh-uh. Now we gotta try to get to our backpack. But the thing's over there! Oh, oh lord. Oh lordy. This isn't good. This is where it all begins. Trying to tame a Peggy. If y'all are playing the freaky drinking game, take a sip. That's death number one. And it's about to be death number two! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Oh, how am I going to get away from this? Oh, I'm going to accept the death. Take another sip, guys. <laughs> I seriously thought that was a pig. Oh. <laughs> well, again. <laughs> Don't spawn me in with the battle music. Don't do it. Put me in a safe area. Oh, this is kind of flat. This would have been nice. <gasps> Bebito! Oh, it's a baby! We're not going to mess with it, though. We got to get to our death. <laughs> That's a lot of red text. <laughs> sure is, man. I just... Man, I was so happy. We... I was like, we got our tools. We got our armor. And it was all taken away in an instant. Okay. Oh, what is that? Ah, oh, damn! No! Number three, get ready. Take a shot. <laughs> Take it. You, you know, no shots. Take a sip. We're it's it's a sipping thing. No alcohol poisoning. <laughs> it's sips, okay? Sips. Respawn random location again. Where am I now? We're near like a crater. I knew I should have stopped at the liquor store or earlier. Uh, uh, uh. What is down there? Why did spawn us up here? Maybe it's better up here, you know? Maybe. I say that and then another cat jumps on my back. Somehow there are even more raptors. Oh my god, no. <laughs> no. Okay, so I hate to say this, but I think it's dangerous that way. What about, oh, it might be dangerous up here. Look at this. I'll take a hit to that. I don't like to drink anymore. If y'all don't feel like drinking, but you still want to participate, you know, water's good for you. Drink some water. <laughs> Just take a huge gulp of water for every death. Hmm. But there's no water up here, so, like, maybe I shouldn't stay here. Do, 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 Hint, Bola's level 9 are your best friend. There's a piggy right there. Um, oh my. Dude. Dude. Punch the bird. Dang it. Take a sip. <laughs> I was minding my own business, and he came running out of nowhere. 
Oh my goodness. Um, okay. New plan. New plan. Uh, hmm. We stay in the area that we spawn in and try to live there. I don't know what we're going to do for water yet. I, I don't know. We're going to get there whenever we get there, okay? <laughs> Respawn. It's 6 p.m. for me, so I poured a small glass of wine for the death sips. Look at you, Sierra. That is so, that's so fancy. I would do the same. I should have gotten some wine. I only have like half, half a year old wine in my fridge. <laughs> There's a titantosaur over there. Titantosaurus. There's a there's a snake. Um Yeah, we're going to have to give up on the Peggy. Let's just start getting Oh my god, is that a snake? What is that? I hear things. That's not a jerboa. What is that? Hello? Oh. It's a bug. That's a bug. I don't think it's mean. We ignore. Oh, God. What is that sound? Oh. 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 Oh, I'm sorry, please. Where's the bug? Bug protect me, please. Maybe we should live by the titanosaur. You know, he seems nice. Maybe... Maybe we can kite things over to it and the titanosaur will protect us. Man, I hate those terror birds. They're so... <gasps> oh, snake. Oh, snake. You know, those terror birds, they just sound so mean. You're not very fast. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go, man. Oh my god. <laughs> I gotta find a better spot. You're kind of cute. Look at you. There's a bunch of, like, flowers over here, too. Hmm. <gasps> Draboa, level nine. I can knock this out. Get down. Come here. <laughs> you rat. I got it, guys. <laughs> okay, what do we put in it? Berries? Come here. We're getting our first aim. <laughs> I got him good. <laughs> Let me collect some more berries to give it. <laughs> I, I'm picking up something. Oh, Jerboa. I was picking up something that was making kind of like a clank sound, but I don't know what, what it was. Uh, our Jerboa's name is gonna be, uh, I don't know. It has a baby. Gremlin? It does look like a gremlin. We'll call it gremlin. Gremlin. There we go. Come on, gremlin. You're not gonna live for long, but, uh, good luck. Here, I'll carry you. Oh my god, can we see? Let me get a close-up of his face. You stay here. Oh, you're pretty cute. You are pretty cute. Is it like a fennec fox? Like a prehistoric fennec fox? I'm gonna pick you up. Oh! Oh, you're cute. Oh my god! <laughs> you're adorable! Okay. We need to go, though, because uh, we're both gonna die soon. <laughs> that is so freaking cute! Is a Jerboa a real animal, like, from the past, or...? I don't know, I've never heard of them. We're picking up sand. What's the sand for? That's what that clinkity sound is. Uh, cactus will store your water, too. Yeah, we gotta find some cacti. Are these cactuses, or are these just trees? I should kill that bug over there. They're real, but they don't look like that. Kind of like a mouse. Oh, interesting. You put hats on them. Oh, my God. I had a baby. Oh, yeah. I don't know where that baby is. I. Is this a old jug bug? I don't have. I'm going to beat it with my hands. 
Come here, you little hoe. <laughs> oh, dang. It's a fly. Y'all didn't tell me this thing flies. <laughs> stupid bug with its stupid wings. Land. <laughs> I really just wanted the water from him. I wanted to see how the water worked coming out of the butt like that. Come here! Oh my god. You know, I give up. I give up. We'll get water somewhere else. We're gonna start making uh, tools. We got our Jerboa. We gotta go back to the primitive tool age now. What do I need to make a hatchet? I need a rock. No, I can make a pick, actually. Okay, we have a pick again. I'm also going to make some clothing. We can't make everything, but we can make a, a couple things. Red have oil. Oh, wait. Blue have water. There's different colors of bugs and they hold different things. Oh, that's crazy. See, there's like so many different new creatures, and I feel like they're way more interesting than the island's creatures. What you saying, dude? I'm gonna put this into stamina. I need more stamina. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and make a pick. Craft one. Hide hat, because it's ugly. That's the most important. Is that a raptor? Oh, please. Oh, we're going into raptor central. We need to go backwards. It's gonna smell us. We need to leave. I know, Jerboa. I know. We're leaving. I need to call him by his real name. Bolas. Yeah, we need to unlock some bo bolas. Let's see what we need for one. What's it mean when he's shaking his tail like that? Does that mean he needs to poo? Don't poop down my back, man. <laughs> I'm having a rough enough day. <laughs> bola. We're using the reusable bola. If you guys are new to this, um... The freaky servers, we only use quality of life mods. They make the game a little tiny bit easier, but they don't impact the game in any major, major ways. So we have this bola we can craft now. Um, we need three hides, so I got to kill something. What, man? He tells you about the weather. I know. <laughs> I know, man. <laughs> but what's he saying? <laughs> I think that's storm. Okay. A storm? Like the sandstorm? Let's see. Hmm. This little area by the cliff isn't too bad. Let me move down here a little bit. Oh, there's a bunch of cacti. And this is a bridge. Oh, I want to live right here. Can I live here? This is actually kind of nice. There's a bunch of cactuses. There's a bridge. That's a little blue water bug. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like this area right here. It's it's safe. It's safer. Sand or lightning storm. How many different storms are there? You're a little annoying, man. Uh, let's go ahead and try and what was that? What is that? I'm gonna go find some hide. I don't think these bugs are going to give us hide, though. I'm going to kill this one with a headshot. A bop. Come here. Oh, come on. How how long does it take to kill a level one? That gave us some keratin and meat. Where does it give us water at? Hmm. I didn't see any water drop from him. People have been saying that they're bugged and won't shut up. Mine does that all day. I, I don't think I want it if it does that like all the time. I think that would be so annoying. I hope it doesn't. Maybe mine will be special and like, I don't know, want to save its voice. Let's see. So... Let me try to harvest a cactus. I want to see what water those give me. Oh, that's my fists. 
We're gonna use the pickaxe. I'm guessing you're not supposed to use your hands on the cactus or it will hurt you. They're both got maps other than SE. Hmm. So by, oh, species Y seed, what is that? Huh, a strange looking plant, which can be used to grow large spores to immobilize humans and small creatures. Interesting. So by chopping down the cactus, gave us some cactus sap. When consumed, it hydrates your body. Oh, by how much? We're going to put this on our hot bar. That seems like an important thing to have. So what do we do now? We need some hide. How do we make like a like a foundation and stuff? I want to make a bed. We need to unlock a sleeping bag. I really want to stay in this area. Sleeping bag. And for that, we will need some hide. So everything revolves around killing something. Let's see. I mean, I could kill my Jerboa. Just say I could, but I won't. Your puppy okay? Heard whining in the background. That was my little Pomeranian. He probably saw another dog outside. I heard him as well. But yeah, they're all good. And he's doing great, by the way. Little baby Oni is doing wonderful. He's learning tricks and... I don't know, being good. He only chewed through one Ethernet cable. <laughs> Is there anything to kill over here? I want like something small, like a Lastro or like another Jerboa. I'm scared. I saw scorpions over here and stuff. I gotta kill something though. Hmm. Oh yeah, Pomeranians love to just hear their own little voice. We're not going to go down there. Um, I really... Mm, I don't want to walk around because <laughs> I don't want to die. I like this area a lot. I feel like I can build here and, and thrive. <laughs> <gasps> Parasaur. Those are stupid little creatures. Um, I'm going to make a spear and we're going to try and kill this thing. I think you can throw the spears. Craft one. We can't make the bully yet. That would have been so easy. I know these things like to, like to run a lot. Hold Q. We're going to put that in our hot bar. Okay, y'all ready? We're going to go on a parasaur hunt. Get ready. I think I can... Oh, can I throw this? No, but we can charge our attack. Right in the head. Die, please. I need your flesh. Dude, come here. I need to make sure I'm not running into like an enemy. Oh, he's gonna be gone forever. They're so fast. Dang it. Well, I think that's a terror bird over there. We shouldn't walk that way. That looks like a tiger. No, that's a kangaroo. He's all the way over there. <gasps> There's another parasaur, but I'm pretty sure we won't be able to kill this one either. If only there was like a baby. There's a bunch of raptors. What? <gasps> Jerboa. I'm gonna take the risk. Oh, Lord. Yeah, they're they're distracted. I'm sorry. We got to kill the Jerboa. I'm so I need the I need the hide. And then I'll run back to where I was. And put down like a, a bed. I should have unlocked a bed. Why did I unlock a sleeping bag? I'm sorry. Oh my god, there's the raptors right next to me. Okay, we got 86 hide. Um, oh, a drop. I can't access though because it's red, right? I'm getting away from that area. What does it cost to make a bed? I'm going to put my bed down. <gasps> Another Jaboa. I'll kill you soon. Uh, just wait for me. We're gonna figure out how to make a bed real quick. Simple bed. Uh, I, I can make it. Good. And can I make a little thatch foundation? Thatch foundation. I will live here. This is my spot. Um, 
I need some more wood. Am I going to die of dehydration? Not before I get some stuff put down. I'm telling you that. Okay, where did I want to live? It was like right over here on the edge. For now, we will put our bed right here. This is a good spot. I like this. Spam the two key. Oh, yeah. I can do that, can't I? Drink some good water. I forgot all about that, actually. <laughs> this is my spot until the first heat wave. Look, it's a temporary... A temporary spot, okay? <laughs> Place. Ew, don't poop on the floor, lady. And then bed. What do I need for bed? I need a little bit more wood. Upgrades, people, upgrades. Oh, what are you doing now? Another storm? I'm just gonna guess that any noise he makes is bad. Okay, now we can make a little bed. Way better than um, what we were dealing with earlier. Place. There we go. And we need to unlock some walls as well. Let's do thatch wall and doorway. And then we can upgrade our person. <laughs> Work towards unlocking the tent as well. Tent. Requires sleeping bag. Silk, hide, th okay. So what does the tent do? A portable tent where you can take co cover in hostile environments. Okay. So this will be our temporary permanent base for now. And then I guess when we travel to look for other spots, we can use the tent. Maybe. We'll see. Oops. The tent is needed for a sandstorm. Can I not just use, like, my thatch hut that I'm about to build? Can you sleep in said tent? Oh, I'm encumbered. Let's build... Four walls. Oh, you can sleep in the tent? Good, good. Good, good, good. Then why am I building a bed and everything? Can you respawn on a tent? Like, as many times as you want. Or is it like a disposable, kind of like a sleeping bag is? This is my hut. Doo -doo -doo -doo. With the little window. Don't forget the window. I'm going to switch where the window is. I'm going to put it over here. I would like this. There we go. I'll put one on this side too. It doesn't really matter. And then here's my little door. Yay! Look at my house. It's good. It's good house. And I make a little ceiling. Good house. Um, thatch, ceiling. This is a good start. I feel very um, accomplished. Okay. Oh, there is a little sandstorm coming. Okay. Thatch ceiling. <laughs> Next, we're going to need like a little storage bin. There's that. Good. I don't really need a door, do I? Let me pick up my bed. Um... I'm going to put it near the back. <laughs> I know it's not much, but, you know, it's mine. <laughs> there we go. Yay. And then we'll build a little storage container. <laughs> I, okay, we'll build a door. We'll build a door. Thatch door. How much is a wooden door? I'm going to build a, a wooden door. There we go. Oh, that unlocked all the... Oh, crap. That's not good. Um... Container? Is that what it's... We're going to type in storage. Storage box. There we go. Learn. 
Yeah. Yeah, good, good. Good, good, good. Make the little storage box. Oh, I need more wood. Okay. <gasps> Servers restart. Where did it say that? Oh my goodness. Okay, so like I said, newer server owner. Um, we haven't really gotten the times good yet, but we can do a little recap, okay? We can do a little recap while the server's shutting down. We'll still have our bed down, so that's good. Now, I was trying to get everything uh, set up today, make it perfect, but, uh, you know, mistakes happen. Couldn't really get this one down. I think that's the only thing, though. Everything else on the server is good, except for the server shutdown time. We're going to go ahead and exit to the main menu and just talk about what we're experiencing right now. We got our bed down. Uh, we got some clothing on our back, a jerboa, um, tools. It's, it's good. It's going great. <laughs> Are y'all enjoying the stream? Mm -mm -mm. Get a, get a little sip of water. I think what's next on my agenda for the Scorch server is... <sighs> hmm. I feel like a bird is way too hard. Maybe we just work on getting like you know our food shelter water better right it went better than i thought it would yeah only four deaths so far did she put a door up raptor food already honestly i don't think that the, the uh, door is gonna help us much because <laughs> we put the windows in and uh, i'm pretty sure that dinosaurs can attack you through windows right Raptor is an easy boa. Uh, we could try a raptor. The only problem is that they're usually in packs. And uh, I just, I don't think that that's going to be a good idea. I think we're going to die a lot, but I'm going to do it anyways. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, a raptor is faster to tame. A meat eater is helpful. We can try to go for a raptor. We will continue to build up our house. Uh, get some food together, some shelter, some water containers, stuff like that. And yeah, then we'll go for a raptor. Seems good. A door helps you, helps protect you from the storms. Okay. Let me refresh, make sure the server isn't back up. Is it? We're going to try to join on it again. See what it does. Let's see. Do, do, do. Accept. <laughs> I don't know why we still have the Love Ascended um, screen. It is what it is, okay? Uh, I think the server's done, I, I guess. <laughs> I guess it did its little restart. We're back on our way to playing. <laughs> Who else is loving the new sand sandstorms, though? I know they're so pretty. Like, it doesn't seem like a lot of dirt flowing around in your eyes would be pretty. But like with the tumbleweeds and the leaves, it's really cool to see. OK, what was I do? I'm going to make an axe and then we're going to make some containers. I'm going to make a stone hatchet. Seems good to me. Put that on our little bar. What I kind of want to invest in is a crafting skill. We craft so slow. I won't right now, but I will later. Instead, let's get some. I'm going to get some more stamina and then a little bit more weight. There we go. Awesome. Awesome. Door and bola. Yeah, we got to make a bola, too, don't we? Yes, we got a bola and how are we going to take down a raptor? <laughs> so I know the whole bola thing, but we have to knock it out. We're going to have to work up to a bow and some narcotics 
and then we can make some trank arrows. So let's go ahead and unlock those as well. So that's a crossbow. Uh, no, we can't have that. We need a regular bow. This? Yeah? Is this the bow we need? I'm so used to making crossbows. We're going to make a crossbow. Use a club. We have a good amount of points, so we'll go ahead and unlock this. It shouldn't take us too much. We're going to need a mortar and pestle. We're going to need some arrows. And we're going to need some trank arrows. Can I not unlock that because I'm not level 21? Oh, no. Well, at least we'll have a bow. You know, maybe we'll become level 21 by the time we get done doing this. So we're level 19. So we'll unlock that later. Now, nah, come on, do it the proper way. I'm doing it my way. Wait, boomerang? What does boomerang do? What is a boomerang? There's something called a boomerang in here? I was just doing it the way y'all taught me. What you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? Boomerang is better on this map? Okay. What does a boomerang do? Your trusty infinite ranged weapon. Okay, so is this like the same as the club, but with range? Interesting. Let's go ahead and try to make one of those. A boomerang is like a throwable club. Interesting. I like that. I like that a lot. Wait, did I just make another pick instead of making a... No, I didn't. Okay. Where is... We got the bola right here. I'm gonna put it right here, actually. We got the spear and boomerang. I need to harvest some more cactuses, too. Uh, when harvesting cactuses, the best thing to use a, is a pick, right? And again, if y'all are new here, if we have any new people to the channel, this is a beginner's arc series. I have played arc like twice in my entire life and I began playing arc a couple months ago. So I don't know that much. So be easy with me. I might pee myself on stream if you're not and cry. <laughs> you don't want that. No one wants that. So uh, yeah, treat this as a beginner series. Give us useful tips of your wise information that you've learned over your years and years of playing arc. <laughs> We find that way more helpful. Um, I think we need to get some wood first so I can put all my stuff in a crate and then we'll do the the raptor thing. Oh, we're going to need meat, though. Ooh, we need We need a better game plan plan. So let's get some wood. What is it? Oh, that is giving me wood. OK. Your pee sounds funny to me. No, because then we'll have to stop the stream and it'll be a whole thing. We don't want that. We're trying to play games right now, okay? Now I gotta stay to coach. <laughs> Incentive. Look at that. Okay, so new game plan. We're gonna make ourselves a little, uh, a little crate. Craft one. Hurry up. There we go. And what do we not need? What do we not want to lose? Uh, oh, I have my sap here. We have a little bit of meat on us. We'll put this stuff in here. Jerboa, can you shush? Shush, shush, shush. Uh, mm, I'll put these seeds in here. Those seeds look cool. They don't expire either. My chitin, my fiber, my hide, my flint. Uh, where are my narco berries? Do I have any narco berries? I'll put those in there. My sand, my silk. That seems good. And I'll have this extra pick in there. Look at that. We already have a little, a little storage. Nice, nice, nice. Waypoint, uh, your base. Oh, that's a good idea, too. Wonderful idea from another newbie. <laughs> Me and Remy. Starting at the same time at Ark. At Ark. She's trying to learn from me. Which is not the best idea. Let's make our little waypoint. Let's make it lavender this time. What's a nice lavender? Lavender. Right. 
There. There we go. That beautiful. Beautiful. Cute. Okay, so let's eat some of our little cacti. The next step of our plan. Let's kill some things. We need meat for our raptor in order to tame it. That's pretty self-explanatory. Oh! <gasps> Look at this! Excuse me? We don't have to drink from water bugs? There's something called a water vein and we live right beside it. Told you there it is. Wait, when? I'm sorry, I missed it. I think hatchet gives more cactus? Oh, okay, I have to remember that. So there's a raptor right there. But I don't really have enough meat. I have 45 meat, and I don't know what level that raptor is. Water, woohoo! When you were in the death loop? Oh, okay, yeah, I was a little distracted at that time. Uh, y'all think... Oh. Okay, okay, plan. We bowl of the raptor. Whoa, 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 whoa! Bowl of the raptor and kill the raptor for hide. What level are you? You're level 90, though. Um. Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna kill the raptor for hide. I think that, er, meat. Death. Oh, crap. <laughs> where's my, where's my boomerang? Uh, I don't know how to use it! Ah! Ah! No! <laughs> Come back here! <laughs> Come back here! You destroyed my spear! <gasps> ah! Ah! No! Stop! <laughs> I'm almost dead! My hatchet? Okay. I'm gonna die! How do you use the boomerang? <laughs> Give me your meat! Death! Sweet death! I'm gonna bludgeon this guy for the next 30 minutes! Oh! Oh! Ah! Oh, ah! Oh. I'm not good on keyboard and mouse! Oh! Oh! No! Dang it! Dang it! <laughs> ah! Everyone take a sip. That's death number five. <sighs> oh no, gremlin! Dang it! <laughs> I did my best. Um, he was so close to death. Okay, so, hmm. Let me see, let me see. I don't think, can I craft myself another spear? What does it take? Crafting sphere, we need fiber, wood, flint. Fiber, wood, flint? Where's my flint? Oh, fiber, we need fiber, okay. We're gonna craft two spears, three. We're gonna make three spheres, okay? Unlock the reusable sphere? Oh yeah. That's true. <laughs> Cancel Q. <laughs> We're gonna unlock the reusable sphere. There we go. And craft that instead. <laughs> craft one. So do I I have these in here. We'll put our two spheres in our box. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> I'm gonna get my stuff and it's all gonna be okay. Though our meat got away. That wasn't supposed to rhyme, but it did. So let's go. <laughs> Is that the one? No, I'm gonna just get my stuff and run. There. It's safer to bola than build around a, a raptor. Oh yeah. I don't have anything to build though. 
Okay, so let's go ahead and put our stuff back on. And uh, go recuperate. We're going to recoup, okay? And we're going to try to throw the boomerang. Because I don't know how. <laughs> okay, this looks good. Let's put this in our bar. Yeah. Yeah. What's this? Oh. Man, RIP our meat. And our gerboa. RIP the gerboa. <laughs> the bola's only good for about 30 seconds. Yeah, we live and we learn. Where's my, where is it? <gasps> I didn't hide my hat, I'm all ugly now. And I'm trying to get this, oh my God. Okay, how do you, give me this. Right click and then, how the heck do I use this? <laughs> I'm gonna get my little thing back out. Y'all know how to use this. You gotta hold yes and then what? I'm waiting for you to come out of that, that thing. Use the reusable sphere. I'm about to. Oh, get away. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please. Please leave me alone, man. Oh, no. Everyone take a sip. Why? Like, sometimes the bola works and sometimes it doesn't. I, I don't know if I'm using it right or not. Upset. I'm upset. Also, I keep leading this raptor closer and closer to my home. <gasps> oh, did I just hit random location? Oh, I think I did. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Um, I need to pull my implant out. My semen implant. <laughs> Respawn. There we go. Did not mean to do that. <laughs> The bed might have been on a cooldown. Oh, we can wait then. Where's my bed? I think it is. How long does it take for the bed to cool down? Mm -mm -mm. After, a, after a dino breaks out of a bolo, uh, I think it has protection on it for a few seconds so you can't re-bullet it immediately. Oh. Yeah, you know, that would probably make sense. Maybe. I don't know if they do or not. I have to pay attention next time. Upset. When do I get my bed? Is there not a counter? Oh, here it is. The counter's right here, if y'all didn't know. We are not going to use the boomerang any anymore. We're going to use the reusable spear. Y'all were like, ooh, boomerang OP for this map. Nope. I don't even know how to use it. It's too hard for freaky brain. Respawn at simple bed. Okay. Again. <laughs> uh, there's a delay on using bolas on something you just trapped. Oh, okay. So a few people are saying that must be true, right? <sighs> there's a raptor close to my bag. This is not good. You can hit with it, too. Still. <laughs> Not in the heat of the moment. Where is my bag? Now I have that death marker. We're going to dismiss that. And I got to find my other one. I'm going to open my map in front of it. <gasps> that could be hide right there. Oh, yeah. If they don't eat that, that's that's hiding meat. Get them, boys. <gasps> Are they going to attack me since they're in a group? Wait a second. <gasps> no! Why? <laughs> Why? You were happy attacking the other thing. <laughs> I stood too close. I just wanted to enjoy the show. <laughs> Why? Now we got to wait four minutes for our bed. <laughs> Man... Well, while we're waiting, we can take some of these death markers off. How do I take these off? 
Why did I do that? <laughs> Why? <laughs> And no, Morella Tops are not territorial. No, but someone said if they're in groups that they'll attack. It's because you were watching it get killed, so it killed you. A another lesson, don't stand near the fights. Maybe, like, go back a good bit and watch from there with, with like, a spyglass or something. <sighs> hit one in a group and they'll attack? Oh, okay. If you hit them first. Okay. Ay ay ay. How do I get rid of these death markers? I might have to do it on a different map. And I hope I can find my stuff. Look at this. It's a whole straight line of death. Ay ay ay. Mm -mm. There are no bystanders in a mosh pit. Welcome in, Brian. How you doing? <laughs> Exactly. Also, guys, if you are new here and haven't considered subscribing yet, I hope that this is your incentive to do so. I hope you've been enjoying this stream thus far and you decide to join the little freaky community and also hit the bell noti. We stream uh, at least three times a week, so you can catch all the streams if you, if you hit that bell noti and tell you when I'm streaming. I walked away for like three seconds. <laughs> what happened? I was standing a little too close to the raptors, okay? <laughs> and I wasn't supposed to be in that spot. Mm-mm-mm. Uh-uh-uh. Only a minute and a half until we can respawn. <laughs> was the raptor too hard of a thing to go for? At least we've been getting, like, one. Like, one raptor at a time, instead of, like, a whole pack of three of them. That's the best thing. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Lordy, lordy. We're gonna have a lot of fun with this map. There's, there's gonna be some cool things to look forward to. But the only thing I'm sad about is I've heard there's only one boss fight on this map. There's only one? And what is it? I was hoping there'd be three, like, like on the island. But I guess not. If. The new caves are beautiful. Yes, the manticore. What is a manticore? Is that a mantis, like a praying mantis? Or isn't a manticore the weird lion person? I don't know if y'all know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Is it the lion person thing? Can I do this and look at a flying lion? Yes. Do y'all want to know how I know what that is? I know it from Adventure Time. I don't I don't know if anyone here has seen Adventure Time, but there's like a cute little manticorn stuck in a bottle. <laughs> and that's the only way I know about this weird thing. The it's a lion hybrid, a lion with a scorpion tail. Oh, that's scary. That's scary. <laughs> Tiny manticorn. <laughs> okay. Y'all ready to respawn and try this again? It's from Greek mythology. Ah, interesting. Island of the Misfit Toys. <laughs> okay. What's going on out here? Where's my door? Did I never build a door? I'm going to regret that, but I'm still not going to build one. I gotta get my stuff. Let me double click on the map and I want to remove some of these death markers, especially the ones down here. Do I hold R? I don't know. Maybe I just have to look at them. We need to get rid of death four and death seven. So I guess we hold R. There we go. Where's death seven at? I don't know. Eh, you know what's fine. It'll come up later. Apparently, if you aim at the dino, then left-click on mouse, you'll throw the boomerang. Aim? How do you aim in this game? I think aim is right-click, and then you left-click. We'll try again. If I can get my bag and find it. I still like this area. 
I just don't like the raptors, but you know, raptors come in at almost every territory, you know? Uh, bag. Hmm. Bag. Y'all remember where the bag was left off? That's a bug. I think I've lost all my stuff. Oh no! <laughs> Probably despawned by now. <sighs> now I don't know. Let me check the map. Oh, we're in the wrong way. Maybe this way? Yeah. Uh, turn this way a little bit. I don't remember dying over here, though. <laughs> Let's see. <gasps> it's a baby one. Oh. Huh. There's another raptor over there. Let me open the map again. Left click it on the map to get a marker. Where is it? I heard it. A kangaroo. Where the heck is my bag? There's a little drop coming down there too. Um, huh. What all did we have on us? It was probably good stuff, wasn't it? Hmm. <laughs> I, now I'm going far. Oh my god, I do, I do not know where these are. It's like somewhere along this route. Hmm. I see nothing. We're gonna have to start over. Okay. I'm sorry. Let me get a drink of water. Oh. There we go. Let's go back. We're going to have to recraft everything because I can't find my bags. <laughs> I need to make a little stairs to lead up to here. Access inventory. I think the game's kind of buggy. Access inventory. Um... It might shut down in a second, because it's not working. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have to re-log in. Give it one second. You know, this is a newly released DLC, so it could be that. We're going to get this raptor. That... We're just going to make that the main point of today's stream, is to get a raptor. Hopefully this helps with the box opening. Hopefully. Considering how often you're dying, it couldn't have been that great of a loss. Well, we're not trying to get our most recent loss. We're trying to get, like, the third one. <laughs> the third one back. Okay, let's try it now. Yep. It was just a, a little issue. Here's our pickaxe, um, some thatch. Let's get a little bit of wood. And again, we have to kill something. First, some hide. Okay, we're gonna make a little hatchet. I need one piece of flint, okay. Where are all the rocks at? There we go. I'm just saying, uh, more, y'all keep spelling it different every time and it's confusing. <laughs> Morella tops, right? Are great starter tames. They're just, there's so many in a, a bunch that I feel like they'd be hard to get to. Craft one. Okay. Here's a little hatchet. 
behind you. Don't say that. Pickles. Don't say that. Okay, let's make our reusable bolas and spears and stuff like that. What do we need? We're gonna need some fiber and for the bola, hide. Okay, let's pick up a little bit of fiber. Some wood. There we go. Um, a little bit of fiber. Make this sphere. There we go. Dire wolves are scary on Scorched. Man, they're scary, like, on the island, too. <laughs> okay, we're kind of back to where we were. Kind of. Let's see. I'm, I'm so glad that we have this water vein near us. It's good. Parasaur would be good. Yeah. But our goal is Bola. Parasaur would be good, though, for the berries. Okay, there's a singular raptor right... Oh, there's one behind it. That That's probably not a good idea. We... We need hide. We can't even go for that until we get hide. Ah, Fluffy. Thank you so much for the gifted memberships. Y'all say thank you to Fluffy. Let's go. Wait, run. Don't don't say run. Why do I keep saying run? Let's go. We love the green names in the chat very much. <laughs> I wonder if you can upgrade a gifted member. Oh, that's a cat. That's a cat right there. And that's a bug. Oh, lordy. I need to get out a sphere. Get get away from me, dude. Now, I wonder if you can upgrade a, a gifted membership. Because if so, y'all could spend, you know, a, a month on the server for half the price. I'm just saying. On this new Scorched server, don't you want to suffer with me? Be pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Some poop on the floor. I'm not seeing anything I can get hide from. I just need a tiny bit of hide. Okay, how about this? How about this? Let's... Go in here. We're going to drop off this stuff that we just made. Oh, that is not what I meant to do. Drop off the good stuff. Uh, yeah. We got some sap. I don't really know what sap does. But we'll put it in there. And what we're going to do is we're going to kill one of the babies. You think if we kill one of the babies, the parents will forget that we killed their ch their child until I respawn? <gasps> oh no, Amanda. I'm sorry you had to go to the vet. I hope your babies are okay. Oni's still getting shot after shot. <laughs> oh no, the baby is not just a tiny infant anymore it's like a teenager oh lordy um really sticking close to your mom hmm i don't know if this is a good idea but i'm gonna do it anyways man i'm gonna do it anyways <sighs> um you know, I'm gonna do it anyways. Oh, lordy. Oh, lordy. Just hug the tree, because it's kind of fat, to be honest. It's it's stuck on the tree. Get away from your mother. Look, 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 look. Oh, this would be so perfect if I had something to knock it out with. I'm gonna just kill the mother. Wait a second. Please, get stuck back in the tree. Oh, lordy. I was gonna say, what if we killed the mother, then was able to take the baby? Wait a second. Wait a second. Woo, woo! Dang it. 
Oh, not working, not working, not working. No, not working. High spot, high spot. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Where's that child at? <laughs> Where's the child? There it is. Come here. God, they have a lot of health. <laughs> Come here. Oh, <gasps> there's a raptor. There's a raptor. Something good has to happen, right? Right. Oh, no, it ain't the baby. If it comes for me, I... T oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm upset. I'm upset. <sighs> Took my baby and killed me. All that effort for why? <laughs> All that effort for why? Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm sad. That was my baby. I I halved its health. I was about to kill it, and then it took my meat. Man. I'm making another sphere. I think I have two in here. I'm gonna take these two spheres. And you know what we're gonna do? We're going to try and find something smaller to kill. We're going to go somewhere else and try to find some smaller prey. Huh? I tried to kill the mother. If you didn't see, we tried. <laughs> yeah, y'all take a sip. That was another death. We're going to put some uh, some points into our person, though. Uh, maybe melee damage. We're gonna put some into melee. There we go. Ay ay ay. I just need the tiniest bit of hide. Just a little bit. Oh, <gasps> there. Hey. Perfect. <laughs> Thank you for your sacrifice, Lastro. I really appreciate you. Oh my god, that's 22 pieces. Okay. Did you have a friend? Did you have a friend? Where's your friend? Kangaroo. There you are. There's his friend. I knew he had friends. Awesome. 23 pieces more. I don't think he has any more friends. Oh my god, it's a Draboa. Somewhere. <gasps> there you are. I don't really have any berries to give you, though. We're just gonna kill you for your hide. I'm sorry. It's gotta be this way. Much love. Your sacrifice is worth a lot. There we go. Okay, we're going back home. do <laughs> Do y'all know um, about those cleaner wipes called Lysol? I'm going to start calling those last rows Lysol. <laughs> Just to see what people say. Ly uh, Lysol sources. <laughs> yeah, the gerbos give a good bit of hide. So let's see. What do we need to make? We need to make a new... Bola. So let's drag over some stone, some wood, fiber, and thage. <laughs> They're to craft. Jeez, I just made the mistake of looking in the food channel. Lordy, y'all can cook. Need me a snack. Sierra, those wraps look so good. Oh, yeah, those were some good looking wraps. I love any Hawaiian flavored stuff. Again, guys, if y'all aren't a part of the Discord, you can find it in the link. The, the description below the links there. I make some good food. I made some uh, risotto 
with shrimp tonight so good i didn't post pictures because i had to eat so fast but uh it would have looked good <laughs> i want to do a cooking stream someday but that's a lot of setup i think next we're going to make we need the reusable sphere yeah so let's get some flint oh i need my my stuff <laughs> put that here i'm not using the boomerang i'm not wasting materials on the dang boomerang okay <laughs> let's go get some flint and we're almost back to where we were before we died <laughs> If I can make enough arrows, maybe I'll go for bow. I'm not really good at keyboards, so like switching to these different things on the hotbar are a little difficult for me. And I feel like switching from bow to spear, I don't know if I'll be able to do it in time. <laughs> but we'll see, we'll see. Let's make a... I need some fiber. Let's make a reusable sphere. I need some fiber from the ground. We can try to make a bow, though. Whoops. There we go. <laughs> I always press the button one too many times. And then it's just like, did I take it out? Did I put it away? I don't know. I knocked out a giga with a boomerang. That's crazy, man. If only I had your talent. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. We need some wood now. Okay. Let's start mass producing the arrows and uh, get some wood. Doing good. We just can't lose our stuff this time. Can I make a bow yet? Maybe. Let's see. There we go. Craft one. There's also a slingshot. That's called a poor man's bow. <laughs> you got this thank you thank you for the confidence that's a lot of arrows we're gonna go ahead and put our stuff back in the in the house though there's a there's a raptor over there we might go for that one i just want to kill it so i can have the meat and hide to go get other ones i have 83 meat actually that might be enough we'll see We'll see how it goes and how I feel at that exact moment. Let's see. Put all that away. I'm going to put this in here. I'm going to split this in half. Put that in there. Is there anything I can drop? I'm going to drop these narco berries. I can always get more. Maybe put the fiber back on my body. I want to drop off my hatchet and my other thing while I do this. Honestly, I'm not going to need these seeds for a while. We're not planting anything for a while. <laughs> so let's put our pickaxe in here as well. So now we got our spear on us, our bola our bow we'll put it here we'll put it in this order we're gonna bowl them first maybe last i don't know we're doing it like this okay we gotta reload our bow i'm gonna practice i don't even know how to use a bow there we go <sighs> where was it at we're going to have to get some headshots. What is that? <gasps> oh, that's a baby. Oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> that was a max level raptor with a friend by my house. I was like, is that a raptor baby? It was. It sure was. <sighs> Everyone take a sip. <laughs> 
Oh my goodness, that's a buy my- that's like exactly buy my base. Oh, what am I gonna do? I don't even have a door! I don't have a door! That's my death right there. <laughs> and that's a raptor and his friend! Oh my god, no! Ah, I should have put the door on! Get away from my house, please! <laughs> okay, we're gonna try and chase him away, man. Come on, get away from my house, get away. At least we, we uh, led them away a little bit. Oh my god. <laughs> take a sip. <laughs> Everyone take a sip. <laughs> are we taking a sip every time she dies? Yes, for those who are wanting to play this game, take a sip. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Number 10. We have to wait four minutes for a bed? I need to make, um, I need to make my little sleeping bags. Man, I just, I just want some meat. <laughs> I might give up on the raptors until I can get some other meat. Let's hope the liquor stores are open late. We gonna need to re-up for real. What time is it? I don't know where my phone is, actually. Let me see. In Eastern time, it is 1030. Yeah, they're still open over here. Oh my god. <laughs> huh. Well, three minutes to kill. Mm -mm -mm. I need a drink of water. There's a lot of raptors where I decided to build. Well, that was a fun couple minutes, but I'm off to work again. Oh, Brian, thank you for coming and popping in. We'll see you in the next stream. You have a good day at work. Mm -mm -mm. We getting tipsy tonight then? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. If you bullet them, then build around them, you have all the time in the world to either tame them or kill them. Well, the problem is, how do you build around them? Because you need to put a foundation down to snap walls to it. I don't have anything to build around them. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Gonna need to walk to the liquor store 10 shots in an hour. No, don't do shots. We're doing sips. Because expect me to die another 10 times. I'm saying that right now. <laughs> I got you, water. I know how to make the, the, the narco narcotics. Mm -mm -mm. If you're new to the channel, check out our past uh, arc streams. We have a whole playlist of... Uh, Oh my god, how many videos are even on there? Let's see. We have to have at least 30 videos in that ARC playlist. If you go to my channel, go to playlist, we have 45 videos in the ARC with Freaky playlist. <laughs> Perfect place to start if you want to see uh, some more ARC content. It's great. <laughs> it's me starting over and over again, just like this. <laughs> Mm -mm -mm. Spiked fences? I could try to put fences around them. Our bed is almost ready. Okay, so new plan. We go get our, our death bag. Maybe. The raptors are probably still over there. And maybe we can build some fences. Or maybe we run off and get meat and hide somewhere else. And then come back to the raptors. I don't know. Freaky, you place the foundation right on top of them. Uh, the raptor will just pop up through the foundation. Oh, I've never done that before. And I'll try that. That'd be better than having to find the fences and hope that those work. <laughs> I'll try it. I was going to put the stream on in the background, but I'm so invested. Our loading screen has been up for a while. Yeah. Um, we're waiting. 
We're waiting. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Okay, our bed is ready. <sighs> Let's try this again. Hopefully the raptor is not at our front door. That would be great. <laughs> Please, do not be at my front door. I led you away. A little bit. So there's some damage being taken over there. Um, I think we're okay to do something. <laughs> I don't know what, but we're going to do... So Here's a spear. How about that? Um, best thing I can do is make another one of these reusable spheres right now. I need some fiber. I'm going to have to sneak out. Raptor right there. <gasps> Raptor right here. Oh, oh, please. Oh, please. I don't want to wait another four minutes. I don't have Ebola. <laughs> Am I fast? <gasps> please hit the dodicarus. Leave me alone. <laughs> please let me up the rock. Let me up the rock. <laughs> no. No. Dang it! <laughs> and I took all my my wood and stone doing that. Okay, how about, how about, we don't wait four minutes for our bed. We try to spawn near our bed, because I don't want to wait again. Respawn, random location, near our bed. We might be able to just walk over to it. Hmm. Okay, so we actually spawn pretty close to our bed. Or at least our death. Taking a look around, maybe... Maybe we find something. There's uh, parasaurs over here. <gasps> There's a jerboa. There's a couple jerboas in the baby. I'm gonna kill your mama. Pop. Give me your flesh, <laughs> please. <laughs> I need it more than you do, I promise. Can I knock this Jerboa out with my hands? You wanna get some? You wanna get some? He has me at half health. Please, please go down. I don't wanna die to a Jerboa. That would be a little embarrassing. Come here, please. <laughs> I just wanted to tame your child. <laughs> What have I come to? I've been winded by the Jerboa. And he's back to finish me off. I'm just gonna stand by your child. You have to come back for this thing. Where you at? <sighs> is it coming back now? It is. Come on, you squirrel. This is not working. I regret. Now I just look like a dumb booty. But I'm a little dedicated. Why are you biting me? Okay, you know, it's fine. It's fine. I don't even know how much health he has. We're going to remember. Let me open the map. Oh, we're a little far away. <laughs> we're just going to have to remember that there's parasaurs over this way. We learn you can't just punch your boa a few times and it and it dies. Anyways, I'm going to sit back while we take this little this little stroll. This is quite the saga. <laughs> it really is. I'm glad that y'all are here for the start of it. <laughs> uh uh uh. What is that? <gasps> oh! Oh! My, I almost jumped off of a cliff. Hmm. There's another Jerboa. There's a Lystro. Little dude. 
Hmm. I'll go to my last death over here. Maybe Raptor Dude isn't here anymore. Who knows? He's probably gone. Went off to see his nice Raptor grandparents for the spring. I don't think I had much up here. There we go. I got my trusty spear, though. <laughs> yep. We're gonna go back up this way. And, uh... Get that parasaur. How about that? Where's my base? If I have Ebola, it'll be really easy. Let me open the map. Um, home is that way. So let's turn it around. Dismiss that. Now maybe the other death. Um, yeah, maybe. We'll see. Because the raptor's right there. They smell pretty good. Like, they have a great sense of smell. Oh, it's a pack. Um. Oh, crap. They took a whiff. They know. They know. Can I just hide in my house? I'll hide behind my house. <laughs> Are they gone? Oh, lordy. I don't have Ebola. It's... It's looking at me. Man. <laughs> Man. I'm just... <sighs> you know what? We'll craft along the way. I'm not- I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna go. You can have my house, actually. Ooh, is that my bag? <gasps> Ooh! Give me that. Yes, yes. Okay, anyways. Yeah, I just- I didn't want that house anyways. We're- we're gonna go up here. And we're gonna go kill the, um, Lysosaurus. And the Parasaur. After we get some hide. Didn't really want that anyways. So the parasaur is right here. What can I get for hide? Where's that little lystro at? He was here. Or like a jerboa. Give me a jerboa that I can, that I can finally kill. Hmm... Albino Anki. Yeah, very cool. Um, shouldn't mess with it, though. It'd probably kill me in an instant. Hmm. Well, I was hoping we'd run into little Jerboa. I just need the tiniest bit of hide. Is that Lystro? Yes! Nice. It's a level uh, 171, too, and I think the higher the level, the more hide and stuff they give you. I'm pretty sure. Do, 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 do. Server restarting in three. In three what? Minutes? Seconds? Why is there server restarting again? 60 seconds. Oh, uh, okay. What? Again, new server owner. We'll just, we're gonna blame this on Ark. It's not me. I'm gonna have to figure that out though. The last restart didn't take too long, so it'll be fine. I broke it, you know. You know, some may say and put the blame on me, the creator who made the server. But, no, it's not me. It's Ark. We're, we're gonna blame Natrato. It's, it's Ark. It's not me. Get on top of a big rock. Well, we have a offline, the offline PvE prevention after, like, 30 seconds of logging off, so it should be fine. 
Man, I'm trying to play on the server and it keeps restarting for some reason. Why? Who knows? <laughs> it was my fault. Blame me and Dodo Trump. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Lord, Lord. Let me check it out. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I don't know why it keeps restarting. I only put one, uh, one automated task on it. Actually, I think I know what I did wrong. <laughs> I think I know what I did wrong. Um, am I able to show you all this? I don't think there's any information on this. That would make it like do anything bad. This is what we have for the server restarts. This is what I put. I think the problem is it says every hour. Maybe it has to be like you hit 23 and it's like every 23 hours it does a restart. I don't know. I have no idea. This is the only part I was kind of confused on. Y'all let me know if, if you know what to do for that. I'm trying my best. Okay. I'm trying my best. Mm. How do I join the the upcoming server you got to be a, a super freak and above as far as membership goes then you just join the discord and look for the the access information it is in pretty letters and it says welcome to arc or something like that very easy to see <laughs> is that it that's probably why it's restarting every hour <laughs> But it's restarted twice in one hour, hasn't it? Here, we're going to remove this. I looked at my other server and it did not say to put 23 hour. So I didn't do it. Uh... You know, I'll I'll mess with it after the stream is done. I'm going to restart the server so that it knows not to restart anymore. And hopefully that works. Mm -mm -mm. Jimmer's tipsy. No, there ain't no way. <laughs> Let's restart. Lego. <laughs> uh uh uh. Lord, lordy. Uh, yes, yeah, set it for daily. Uh, not when you stream. Yeah. We'll get another provider if you pay for it. Water, right? <laughs> this is what we got. <laughs> we're we're using the Trotto till. Someone offers to pay for a whole year membership somewhere else, okay? Year. Not month. Year. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Lord, Lord. But yeah, we just gotta wait for this to start back up. It won't take too long. How much? I don't know what other server, server providers there are. Name the website and I'll look at how much a yearly membership is. <laughs> Let's see. We're going to refresh the page, see if it's back up. We're going to kind of try to load into it.
here we go. Let's see. <laughs> no, our uh, our island server isn't like this at all. It is on a very good schedule as far as daily resets. There's only one reset a day. This is a new server. I haven't completely looked into uh, how to do the time thing. I had help with the first one. So we'll get this uh, taken care of as soon as possible. Don't let this put you off to join the server. <laughs> it is, uh, it's not a regular thing that happens. What's the better torches mod? Uh, it's where you don't have to put fuel in torches. So they'll just, you can light it and unlight it, not having to put wood in them. I thought it was nice. It's them or you can host your own if you have the internet and another computer that can handle it. Oh, so do something that'll be, you know, three times the amount. Yeah, yeah. I'll stay with Nitrado. <laughs> I do not want to build a whole nother PC. It was a uh, hard enough building this one. I am not tech savvy. If y'all could not tell, I am not tech savvy. <laughs> Yeah, we got some nice uh, quality of life mods on here. Nothing to change gameplay, just to make the game like a little, not easier, but less grindy, I would say. I have to uh, show y'all the list of them if this doesn't work. I don't know where to find it. Well, I, I guess I can go on the website, show y'all. Come on, server, are you back up? It says you're back up. There we go. Okay. We are back in. It should not restart again, so... It should be all good. Freaky, I think you're doing a great and wonderful amazing, and you're getting way better every day. In the game? Kinda. <laughs> oh, don't get me wrong, Dave. Arc is still very grindy. Like, this does not take away from the grindiness, and it only makes it, like, 1% better. And maybe we got some aesthetic mods on here. Excuse me. What happened? Oh, it, it crashed. Okay. okay. I understand. Okay. Guys, the game crashed. <laughs> um. Give me a second. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let me, let me get this settled. The server is back up. It's just the game crash now. Where is my task manager? The one thing I do know how to do. Oh, on the screen I can't access. Okay. Okay. Um. Hmm. It's giving me a crash for trying to close arc. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go on a quick BRB. While I get this sorted out, it'll take no more than like two minutes.
Okay, there we go. We are all back. I got the game loaded up. And how? How dare y'all? That green eyeball in my old BRB screen is not from Minecraft. That is the one and only Gaelic Gladiator Jacksepticeye. Excuse y'all. <laughs> okay, anyways, let's get back on the server. Should be all good now. Um, there we go. Here is the uh, mods that we have on the server. If anyone was, was wondering, we have the Super Spyglass mod that basically gives us the stats of dinosaurs. Uh, doesn't change anything. It just tells us their stats before we, we tame them or when they're tamed. We got the greenhouse glass fix, so it makes the greenhouses uh, kind of like the old evolved ones. We got better canvases, gives us bigger canvases and smaller canvases and different types of canvases. Better torches, no fuel for torches, they just stay lit. And uh, we got the death recovery stone, y'all know what that one is. Cryopods, y'all know what that one is. Uh, the stacking mod, which allows us to stack more of one item on one stack. <laughs> uh, the reusables is what we've been using for the tools. So like the pike, it's reusable, or not the pike, the spear. And then we have oceanic platforms. That allows us to put big platforms on the water. So just quality of life stuff, just some aesthetic stuff as well. Not much, and uh, we keep the mods below a certain download size, so it doesn't mess with the server as all, at all. So even if you have like a, um, a lower quality build, or if you're running it on console or something where you're concerned if you can run these mods or not. You definitely can. They're not even a gigabyte large. We keep them very small. <laughs> do you actually have it? I do have some Jagsepticeye um, plushies. I don't know if I have just an eyeball, but I do have stuff with an eyeball on it. He is a, my favorite content creator. Him and uh, his Irish buddy, Call Me Kevin pretty good shout out to them they're awesome <laughs> big platforms on what water oh yeah we don't have to have that mod for this server i honestly just uh you know took the mods from the island server and put them onto this one <laughs> never heard of the better torches or canvas mod i just didn't want to have to put wood in the torches uh for the community center so that's what we're using mainly for that it's pretty good what was I in the middle of doing? So, we have a spear on us. That's about it. I think what we should do is get some wood and uh, get our little tools back together. And I want to try to tame something. Oh, there's a blue drop. That could help us out a lot if there's good stuff in there. I think I'm a high enough level to do it. Hmm. Let's see. How much for a Nitrado server? I'm paying uh like $26 for oh, we're not level 30. I'm paying like $26 for 22 slots. I think that's like an estimate. Don't don't quote me, okay? It's no less than $25. <laughs> Um, we are level 22, so we're not going to be able to get this blue drop, sadly. Oh, that's sad. That's so sad. But I'll go ahead and start making the tools. Yeah, that's for a month. We'll go ahead and put our points into some health. <laughs> and, uh, I guess we'll start crafting hatchets and pickaxes again. Where is pickaxe? I'm gonna need some stone. I should have gotten some stone. <laughs> I should have gotten the pickaxe and the axe, to be honest. No, that gets stone good. Craft one. Let's craft us a bola. And that should be good. Let me put all this stuff on my hot bar now. There's my bola. Do we need anything else? I can't think of anything. I want to start looking into how much it's going to cost for a foundation or 
Something like that. Actually, here here's a question. So I was told that we could put a foundation on top of the Thames that we're trying to get. But we can only make thatch foundations right now. So, like, I don't think... I don't think that's a good idea, because that's just super easy to damage. So they'll get out of that fast, right? So we probably shouldn't use a thatch foundation. And I don't know if wood is much better. We can try a wooden one. Wood would be, that would be good. Let's try it with a wood foundation. Do we have to put walls around it if it's going to be stuck in the foundation? I guess so, yeah. Let's see what we're going to need. We're going to need a bunch of wood. Oops. There we go. Yeah, I'd love to do stone, but... Mm. Oh, the parasaur. Oh, that's a cute one, too. I kind of like this blue parasaur. I want it. <laughs> But I don't have anything to knock it out with. Hmm. Can I club this thing to death? Or will I have a chance of knocking it out? Oh god. Never mind. Never mind. I'm kidding. There's a pack of three raptors. We're going this way. Never mind. <laughs> Where is my house? I don't... I don't know. Okay, it's straight. <sighs> we just got our tools. God, there's so many raptors in such bad spots. <laughs> hmm. Well, here's our house. <gasps> what is that? Oh! It's the little ankle! Wait, no, this is the, the Dickosaurus. Never mind. Wrong one. This would be really good. Hmm. Hmm. You can't bola this, can you? I don't think so. I just want to tame one thing this stream. That's it. <laughs> just one. <laughs> if you're gonna club it, you just gotta keep saying go to sleep. I hear it helps. I'll keep that in mind. Let's see. So we're just gonna need a bunch of wood. Don't worry, sir. You'll be mine soon. <laughs> and it's getting nighttime. That's not good. We're making a little taming pit right now, okay? Because my main goal of this stream is to tame at least one thing. That'll make me happy. That's my goal. Oops. Also, we're kind of thirsty, so we're going to get a little cactus real quick. Or where's that water well? I don't want to go too far away. I need a torch. Here it is. Man, I'm glad I lived by this, even with all the raptors. You tamed your bow early? But that's true. But that was easy. I want like a big tame. A tame as big as me, at least. I want this Dickosaurus over here. I think I only need three, and let's unlock the little... the ramp. It probably won't go into here, but we're gonna try it either way. Okay, I need a little bit more fiber, and then we'll be good. I, 
unequipped the dang thing, lady. And I might make a torch. I need a torch to, to put down. Craft one, and we're gonna... What the world? <laughs> what is that music? What was that? <laughs> There we go. Now we got a little torch on our body. It's gonna be annoying, but it's fine. It's great. Okay, little pit. See, you don't even have to um, have pants to do the fire crotch thing. Wait, how did I put it down? There. Okay. Awesome. Um, we just need a little ramp and we should be good. Hopefully only one ramp. Not that I think this is going to work, but this is the way to do it. So we're going to do it this way. <laughs> Place. I need one more. But where is it being held? Um, you know, we just have the flame up against our body being held by our little panties, okay? That's how it works in arc. Why is this so tall? This looks wrong, but I don't know why. Okay, so... Next thing I want to do... Let me go around. I want to get a bunch of berries. We're going to make some, uh, trank arrows. <laughs> How many we got? Let's see. We got 68. So we're gonna try to lead it up in here. Let's make some narcotics. I'm gonna need, oh, I have more in here. Nice. We need to make this, so we need some more stone. Should have done this at the start, but it's fine. Oh, that's not my axe or my hatchet. That's my pickaxe. I need a little... I meant stone, not wood. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. We need to spoil our meat. I don't really have much meat. Split. Oh, there we go. We'll have to find some more meat later. I forgot about that. I don't know why I thought it was only um, the narcotics for a second there. And craft. I'm gonna need another bow as well. Here's this. Let's put our bow in our hot bar as soon as it's ready. Man, I had so many arrows on that character. Oh, I might have arrows in my box actually. I do. I have 50 arrows in my box, I think. Yeah. There we go. Um. I can't just put this on the floor. <laughs> we get this by our, by our bed. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um. Now we need to unlock the narcotics. There we go. And... Trank arrows. We're halfway there, everyone. Halfway there. Where did my... Where did my... Uh, there we go. My light go. Here's these. I can craft four. <laughs> We're working on it, okay? We gotta wait for the meat to spoil. 
and uh, then we'll be good. But for now, we'll just keep collecting berries. And uh, I think that we're going to need a bit of stone, but I forgot for what. Oh, the, the arrows. We're going to need more arrows over time, so we might get a little bit more stone. I feel like there was something else I needed the stone for, but I can't remember now. You got meat in your box? <laughs> Horrible reading it back. <laughs> dirty, y'all dirty. <laughs> oh my god, the turkey said he's proud of me? That's so sweet of you, man. You're so sweet. <laughs> Man, that, uh... Oh, no, he's still there. The little dickosaur is still there. Nice, nice. Let's see. At least we got a bunch of fiber now. That's nice. Um... Yeah. Yeah. Is this meat rotten yet? No, it's gonna take a while for this meat to rot. I should have done that a lot sooner, but I, I honestly forgot. What we're gonna do instead, while we're waiting for this meat to rot, is kind of... We need a better place, okay? The thatch hut is not... is not awesome. <sighs> Alright, here's the finding another server... server provider, or towards one of the many babies on your PRB screen. <laughs> and please, just call them a... A Deu and not a Dickosaurus. Man, Dickosaurus is part of the community, man. <laughs> Have a great night, everyone. I hope your journey on Scorch is amazing. I appreciate that water. We'll use it for good. I don't think there's any other service providers at the moment, but hey, I'll use it to make the server better <laughs> by fixing the settings after stream. We'll see you in the next stream, and you have a good night. Thank you so much for the donation. You're awesome. There we go. I want to make more, uh, more wooden foundations and such. This is my goal right now. We need more wood. Fiber. Okay. I thought I had fiber. Yeah, and Trotter are private, sadly. Yeah, I remember when, um, when ASA first came out and Tag was hosting it off of his own computer. Oh, it was, it was horrible. Terrible. He was always busy making sure that server was uh, up and steady. So we're going to craft four of these. And then we're going to craft two, four, six, eight. Eight of these. I would like a door. And we need four ceilings. We're making a house, okay, while our meat is spoiling. I think that's a good plan. Pick up my little mortal and pistol. God, I can't see because this light is terrible. Uh, you could drop that foundation to the ground, make it a bit lower. I was wondering why it was so tall. I didn't really, I didn't really like have it up that high. I didn't think. As soon as we're done crafting these, uh, the walls and the foundation, we'll destroy this. I don't want anything to come by and me not have a bed put down. I would be very sad. I think we're good. Okay. Let me pick this up. <gasps> oh, I was going to put it in this exact spot, but I forgot my little chest was in there. <laughs> we're just going to put it here. We're gonna put it almost next to it, okay? That is good enough. Same area. Place. Now this, this is a real home. <laughs> no, put up new place first. I'm working on it, I'm working on it. Place. We're gonna put the doorway. And then wood wall. And I've heard about the adobe um, structures in this map. I'm excited to find out about those. 
I'm not exactly sure how you build them. I'm gonna put a window here as well. We're aesthetic like that. We have two windows. We're fancy. Place. There we go. <laughs> uh, we'll get a door. Uh, we'll, we'll get a door. Oh my God. <laughs> there. There we go. Let's put our ceilings. And because we're so fancy, I think we're gonna do something else. Oh, dang it. That's not, that's not right. There we go. We gotta have all the ceilings going the same way. Why is the menu acting weird? There. We're gonna do something else special, okay? We're gonna go into our Enneagrams and upgrade from the storage box. We're gonna make a large bookshelf and make one of those. We will no longer live out of a box. Ooh, and all of our meat just spoiled. Nice. Um, wait until you get into the Adobe housing. Oh, I'm excited. I've used it before in Evolved. It was uh, on Aberration when I was playing with a bunch of friends once upon a time ago where I learned nothing about the game. <laughs> And uh, it was fun to build with. I liked it. Okay, let's uh, make a little... Don't judge how I use my anagram points, okay? <laughs> We're making a table. Oh, look. Saloon table and poker table. I'm going to have to get that DLC. Maybe we use the super chat for the DLC. And make a chair. I'm all about aesthetic, okay? That's what makes me happy. Oh, we already have a wooden chair. That's nice. I'm all about aesthetic. That's what makes me happy. <gasps> oh, no. How do you get metal and, scor and scorched earth? We can't make a table. Oh, that's so sad. Okay, we have, we have chair. We have chair. Can you use the poker table, though? Because that would be fun. That would be good. Chair in the corner. Perfect. Let's put our little mortal and pestle down. And disable that snapping. There are metal nodes. I haven't seen any, though. The river rocks give metal. Yeah. I... I thought I saw something out here. I'm glad I didn't. Okay, let's pick up our bed. Uh, oh, I can't pick it up. Oh no. Um, I think a bed takes hide and I only have three hides, so we might have to keep bed here. Yeah, no, we are not moving our bed right now, but I will take all of this and pick up my box. And I guess put some more storage points into myself. Some weight points. There we go. Maybe some more health points. And put my box in here. I need a staircase. I feel so accomplished even more now. Put the box here. Oh, this is nice. This is real nice. <laughs> Repair it, then you can pick it up. Um, Let's see. Can I repair bed? I don't see anything for repairing or picking up, sadly. Hmm. She said pick up her box. Why is that funny, troll, huh? The poker table is fully functioning. Oh my god. I have to get this DLC. I have to. For the server, I have to. I need someone to tell me, though. Um, does everyone on the server have, have to have the DLC? I'm assuming so. I'm assuming so. Let's see. What do I want to put in this box? Let's put some, some stone, some sand. Uh, I'll, I'll just put this stuff. I don't really care what goes in here. Actually, I need this. Um, fiber. 
<gasps> I have 182 hide on my body. What? Where? How? Bed. Give me this. And wood. Repair? Or to craft, I mean? How did I not see that much hide on my body? <laughs> Yay. <laughs> yeah, I did not see that hide at all till now. <laughs> It's fine, you know, I'm blind, I wear glasses, I can prove it. <laughs> but here we go. Yay! And what's the time in game? 118, we got a little bit longer till the till the sun comes up. No, I can't pick up the bed, I found that out earlier. That's so sad. That's so sad. Glasses, yeah, I wear glasses. I sure do. You can look back at the last stream. I was a four eyes in that one, and I'm a four eyes now. We'll just transfer all these items in here and take out what we need. It'll be faster that way. Let's get our spoiled meat. That seems good to me. And now let's start making our narcotics. Drugs? We can make 39, so that means 39 ammo. Noise, noise, noise. Pick up the platform under the bed. I don't know, but sometimes I can't pick up my bed. Let's see. I think it's gonna break the bed, but honestly, I don't care. We already have another bed. Yeah, it all broke, but it's okay. It's fine. Maybe it will fly off in the wind and help the environment. <laughs> Who knows? Um, another thing I wanna do, just for the sake of uh, I don't know. I mean, not functionality. Because this isn't, I don't think this is going to help us any. But it's going to make me feel like it helps us a little bit. I'm going to put some stairs in front of the doorway. Mm -hmm -hmm. There we go. This is nice. I like my square house. And you know, I'm not a beach bob because there's no beaches. So, square house club. Gang gang. <laughs> okay. There we go. We have built um, not just a shack, but a little cabin. We're calling this our cabin, okay? We went from thatch shack to cabin. I think that's quite the upgrade. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we have a door now. We have a freaking door. Uh, Freaky, the DLC pack of Bob's uh, Tall Tales is optional. But, like, if someone has it, I feel like the rest of the server has to have it to interact with the stuff, right? <laughs> You're a dust bunny? Uh-uh-uh. <laughs> Great idea. Help the raptors get up there. <laughs> well, we have a door now. It's gonna be fine. And maybe, just maybe... We can shoot outside this winder. This this little winder right here. I need to put this torch away because it's it's kind of annoying. How do I There we go. Yeah, I might be able to shoot out the window. If I stand like right here. Uh no whole server doesn't have to have. Ooh, then yeah, I'm gonna get that DLC. How much is the DLC? Does anyone know? I'm gonna guess it's ten dollar. I'm gonna hope it's ten dollar. <laughs> okay, so oh, there's a parasol right here. It's a level ninety pair. Ooh, all the tames are coming to us now. Twenty five. So in USD, that'd be like twenty ish. Oh my god, why is it so freaking dark in here? What in the... How? How did it get so dark in here? I was able to see in the past. Oh, huh, that must have been a glitch. What is that? Anyways, let's see how far along we are with this. We can have all of it now. Awesome. Yeah, we'll have to get some more meat, but, uh... For now, we're getting that parasaur. Where is... We don't live out of the box anymore. Where's this? We're gonna start making our trank arrows. Hopefully that little dude stays there. Craft all 39. There we go. 
It's thirty dollars. Oh my goodness. Maybe it'll go on sale. <laughs> That'd be cool. It probably won't. Um, I want to see. I, I want to see how much it. I don't even know where my phone is. Every time I get on my computer, I just throw my phone across the room. <laughs> Uh, DLC is twenty nine ninety nine on Steam and American Eagle Bucks. Oh my, why? Why? That's a lot of money. <laughs> that is almost. Wait, how much was this game? This game was thirty bucks, right? That is like the same price as the game. What do you mean? Yeah, we need a scorch sale. Uh, but also includes the DLC for the two maps later. Hmm. So is it a DLC or is it a uh, like a Game Pass thing? What's it called? I forget the name of it. So I'll have to do more research into it. <laughs> so it's not a pay once kind of thing or is it? Put that in there. Snail games and half snail games have too many legal issues, so they being greedy. Eh, it'd be like that. <laughs> okay, y'all ready to get a parasaur? I'll look into the DLC later. We will probably have it for the next stream. <laughs> Most likely. 90% chance we'll have it for next stream. Be nice if it went on sale though. We're gonna bola the parasaur. It's pretty colors too. It's got blue on the top, yellow on the bottom, sunset looking. Bop, there you go. Let's get out our bow. Start shooting it in the head. I'm just shooting, man. Now we can kind of relax. I put a couple of them in there. We'll shoot every five seconds now. Yay! Woo! Oh my, we don't have any berries. Um, dang it. I thought I had the berries on me. I think I have berries in my, in my chest. You get the stuff for the other maps when they release? When they release is the, is the key point right there. Oh my god, it's so dark in here. I'm gonna have to put up some wall torches. Um, I have 199 Miho berries. Nice. Lovely, lovely. You mean if they release? That's what I'm saying. I'm sure they will. Um, maybe when I'm 80. <laughs> Um, I just got both of mine killed by terror birds. Both of your what? Your parasaurs? It's a it's DLC for three maps, so about ten dollars a map. It's a decent deal. I have to look at it. Um, I'm not sure. Oh God. Yeah, I don't know much about it at all. I know there's train tracks. That's it. Train tracks and a and a poker table. I hope this uh the storm is is okay for us to stand out in. I heard that it doesn't do damage to tames, so I'll go inside. <laughs> That's fine. Parasaurs, mine was 145 pre-tame too. I need to focus on God I can't see. I need to focus on making a, a pit for my dinosaurs to stay in. They can't come in the house right now, sadly. Um, wall torch. I would like a wall torch for my house. I can't see. Wall torch. There we go. Oh, that's a metal ingot that it needs. And cementing paste. Okay, let's type in torch. Maybe there's a standing torch that costs less. Oh yeah. Give me this, this standing torch. 
I just, I can't see. And y'all can't see? This isn't fun. <laughs> Where is it? Where is it? We need... Flint, thatch, stone, and wood. Uh, flint. Thatch. Wood and a stone. Craft one. There was one thing, another thing I wanted to make. I think it was the, the pit, yeah. We need to start making a, a pit for our dinos to stay in. We are having a blast. <laughs> I'm glad. <laughs> Can you get struck by lightning? I'm not sure. I don't think so. <gasps> Learn your saddle. That's a good tip. Yep. Thank you. <laughs> Parasaur saddle. That's a good tip. Thank you. <laughs> uh, Just random lightning strikes. <laughs> yeah. I, I don't know if you get struck by lightning, but I'm going inside just in case. It gets really cold at night. Yeah, I saw the snowflake. Thankfully, it went away in the house. Let's see. We got our little saddle. It's probably going to cost a lot of hide to make it, though, sadly. Yeah, it costs 80 hide. We're going to be using a bunch of our hide to make this. But we need it. <laughs> People are saying no, so one less thing to kill you. Yeah, that's true. That is very true. But it does knock out all the electrical for a duration of the storm. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like that. I think the storm's over. Let's put our little torch down. I'm going to put it right here. And light. Oh! <gasps> Oh my god, I thought there was a bug in my house. It's just a tumbleweed. Don't worry, guys. It's just a tumbleweed. <laughs> that was scary. And I think there's a jerboa outside my house as well. Put all this in here. Get my little satel. Reusable bola will save your hide. Yeah, we got the bola, bola on us right now. I hear a jerboa. Where you at? Where you at, little honey baby? You're very close. Am I stepping on you? Where's it at? Level 36? Oh, that's a pretty one. I don't think it matters what level it is. We're gonna steal your baby. Come here. Dead. We're dead. We needed the hide too, and they give a good bit of hide. Where is your child? It was bright yellow. Little Jerboa baby. <laughs> Where are you? <laughs> oh no, we lost the baby. What the heck? Y'all see it? I don't. <laughs> Be nice if it was light outside. Do y'all see this? Where in the world? <laughs> Probably hiding under a rock so I don't kill it. Well, um, bad news. We don't get Jerboa. <laughs> Maybe next time. <laughs> we'll find more. That just pays for our saddle. Oh my god. That scared the heck out of me. Oh my goodness, my heart. <laughs> that torch broke and I was like, whoo. <laughs> um... Yep. R.I.P. the Jerboa. Where is my Parasaur? We'll celebrate the Parasaur. <laughs> Clip saddle. Look at that. Uh, and we'll put this into... What? Uh, weight? Me melee damage. Let's do some melee damage. 
I think that makes it so we collect more berries. Yay! What's the naming scheme? It didn't even let me name anything. It just said, here's your baby. I think you have to be in a certain radius. So let's park this cute little baby next to our house. We need to build a pit. Like, now. <laughs> the naming status, or name naming uh, scheme for the uh, Parasaur is going to be Cookies. Y'all think of a cute name relating to cookies or biscuits for the weird UK people. Um, for this Parasaur, name your favorite cookies. I'm going to take down this taming pit because we're going to need the materials for our pin. And I guess I'll just put it on this side. Lemon drop cookies. What's a lemon drop cookie? That sounds good. We don't really need a foundation. Let me put that back in the house. Snickerdoodle. Oh, I like Snickerdoodle a lot. Butter biscuits, chocolate chip, Oreo, Girl Scout. <laughs> oh, my bad. <laughs> Snackerfice. Oh, my. Snackerfice is really cute. That's a cute name. <laughs> hmm. I like uh, Ginger Snap. That's a good one, too. I think I think Ginger Snap is my favorite one. Snickerdoodle was pretty good too, though. I'm gonna give y'all one more minute while I make some more uh, some more stuff, and then I'll decide. We're gonna we're gonna make some quarter walls. I might have to unlock that. Let me see. Quarter walls. Yep. Yeah, I think we're going to go with, hmm, fudge round. Ew, I do not like fudge rounds. I'm sorry to those of you who do. Also, I've never had a tag along. What flavor is that? I heard about them. We're going to go with Ginger Snap. I, I think that's a really cute name. We'll name them that as soon as I get done uh, doing this good stuff. Where's my wood collection? There we go. We'll just make as many as we can. <laughs> Thick mint? Oh my god, that one's good too. Thick mint's pretty good. What color is he? Blue and orange? Hmm. Oh my god, is that the start of, like, a new day? That's when they play the music? Oh, there's a blue drop as well. I'm gonna take these. Get off of the dino. Gender snap. Did I hear that right? No. You mix blue and yellow makes green like mint. <laughs> We're, you know, I said, I said the, the, the snickerdoodle one or which one did I say? Ginger snap. I said ginger snap, but honestly, I think snacker is, is the best one. I know it's not like a, a cookie name, but it, it's, it's brilliant. I like those, those other ones were great too, though. How do, how do you even spell that? Snack. Rye fight. Wait. Rye. C. -E. There we go. Accept. Our first big tame snack or fight. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Okay, you stay here. I have a plan. We're going to go get this blue drop. It should stay there for a little bit. I'm going to put down as many of these little um, quarter walls as I can. And uh, then, wait, then we're gonna drop some stuff off. 
And hopefully we can make it over there with no raptors. Um, I'm going to make the ugliest pit known to man. Uh, can you snap to the right place? God, I hate the snap points. I hate them so much. <laughs> How do you make hmm? <sighs> Fence foundations? You need fence foundations for where? Where are these fence foundations? <laughs> I've forgotten everything. Wooden fence foundation. Okay. So we gotta harvest some more wood. Let's put our stuff back in here. We'll get that in a second. We'll get all that going in a second. We're going to put this stuff away just in case. Because you never know what's going to happen. You never know. I'll take my spear with me, actually, just in case. And uh, we're going to see about that blue drop over there. <laughs> yep, was just typing it. I've forgotten. It's been so long since I've used these fence foundations without, like, making them into just a railing around a building. Not seeing anything bad. That's a cool looking parasaur, though. There's another Jerboa over here. Is that it? We'll have to see what level that is, uh... In a second. I think we're good to rob this. <gasps> we got some booties that we won't use. Um, a bear trap. Preserving salt. A painting canvas. Some oil. Some fish. Some more preserving salt. And cactus sap. I don't know if any of those are going to help us right now. The sap, I guess. Hmm. Interesting. First drop of the series. Let's go. Not terrible. Oh my god, this one has two babies. Okay. Plan. This time we'll keep an eye on the babies. I promise. I'm not keeping an eye on the babies. I'm just making sure not to take any turns. Get that hide. Okay, turn right back around. They were here. They were exactly behind me. There we go. Hi, little baby. Come here. Who who wants to name Jerboa number two? Just put food related names in the chat. For now, we name him period. And I'll just pick my favorite food name. You need some berries. I don't have berries for you. Um, I thought I brought my berries, but I guess not. I know, little baby. Diddle dip? What is diddle dip? <laughs> Excuse me. What is diddle dip? Nugget? Nugget's pretty cute. Here's some berries. Hope you like them. I'll give you these too so you don't starve. Hoagie? Oh my god. Hoagie is adorable. Moon pie, lasagna, Snackerfice Jr. <laughs> Scampy. Scampy's a cute one. Mac and cheese. I like Hoagie the best. I I don't know if there's a better one right now. I'm naming him Hoagie. That's that's a good one. There we go. Okay, Hoagie. Let's go uh, homie. I, I tried. I tried to make the joke. It didn't fit. Okay, <laughs> I tried. <laughs> Cream pie. That doesn't fit this one. This is little Hoagie. I want to get a reptile and name and name it after Hoagie. Oh, that'd be cute. Come on, little baby. You'll grow up on the way there. I don't think you can pick up babies. Mm, I don't think so. He has to walk. Mm -hmm. 
We do face cams every so often here, but uh, tonight is not the night. My hair is wet from earlier. I took a shower right before stream to wake up. <laughs> but maybe next stream. We did a, a face cam on Wednesday, which was nice. He's almost an adult. Look at him. He's gotten all big and strong. Almost there. Are you big now? Oh, here you go. I mean, we're basically home, but... Oh my god, this one's pretty cool. It's black and white. We're just gonna leave him in the house. We don't really need to carry him along with us. There you go. So... Now what we're gonna do is we are going to collect some more wood. Oh, that is not the button for wood. <laughs> <laughs> so it would have been a moist face cam is that what you're saying yeah basically nah we just chilling today we just chilling sometimes we have the face cam sometimes we don't it's a uh, it's a, what's that called? A box of chocolate surprise. I don't, I don't know. I was trying to make a comparison. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. They can alert you to sand, sandstorms and max level dinos? And max level dinos? Hmm. Interesting. <gasps> oh, we need water. I need to drink all of this cactus stuff. Man, this cactus is pretty good, actually. There we go. Okay, so let's tra transfer our stuff. I don't... I don't know what this preserving salt is. Created by grinding sulfur in a mortar and pestle. Preserves food. I don't really have any food to preserve, to be honest. I will split the stack, though. There we go. Transfer the sap. The bear trap. <laughs> I don't think we really need to transfer anything else. I think we're good. Oh, wow, they actually make cactus sap give you water now? Yeah, it kind of makes it easy, doesn't it? <laughs> Easier. They do max level alert. That's pretty good. Hmm. So, we're going to try and make those fence foundations now. We need a bunch of thatch, and we'll just make 15 to start off with. That should be a good number. And can I go ahead and unlock a little dino gate? It's probably going to be expensive. Wait. Where is it? It's probably going to be a little more on the expensive side. But it's fine. It's all good. <laughs> and then the little gate. Dino gateway. Or oh, why is it not called a dino gate? I, I was so sure it was. Wood gateway. Maybe I'm thinking about something else. We'll make one of these and a little door. We're getting so much closer to having something to our name. <laughs> and then a little protection for our babies. Uh, how are you enjoying Scorched Earth Freaky? Just got home for a few drinks. Hope I didn't miss much. Um, I hope you took at least 10 drinks because that's how many we died. I'm really enjoying it though. I like the, el uh, the weather elements. I think they're really interesting and they add a lot to the gameplay. And uh, I like the new creatures. I like the difficulty aspect. I'm having a lot of fun. Yes, yes, yes. But glad you made it home safe. Thanks for checking back in with us. Okay, there we go. Let's go ahead, take this back. Mm hmm. <laughs> Uh, preserving salts double the spoiler times of food related items, but how do you use it is my question. Oh, this is not it. 
Here we go. One, two. And then I want to put my... My gate here. Oh, that's not going to line up at all. We'll have to wait. Three, four, five, and six. Then put it back here. One, two, and three. Oh, maybe not three. Maybe only two. We'll see. I might be able to, to fit three back here. We'll just attach it here and then run it across. Because I need a little more space. This is not a big pit or pin. I need more. And we'll put it just about here. That looks good. Now we can take this off and this one, put it back in this corner. Connect that all up. Awesome. Put our little door down. We're almost done. We might need a bunch more of these quarter walls, though. I don't think we'll exactly have enough because it has to be too tall. We can't just have a one tall dino pin. That's not safe. That's not safe at all. Oh, I accidentally used two of them. I don't have the wood to waste. There we go. There we go. Um, to use preserving salt, just keep it in your inventory. Ah, that's cool. Has it restored your faith in art, in art yet? Um, you know, slightly. Slightly, slightly. I'm gonna go ahead and put a sweet snackerfice in there there we go that should be good enough maybe if i have the resources i'll make it three tall i don't want anything to happen to snackerfice even though it's in his name do we have any wood in the box we have a little bit of wood in our inventory We can make 11. That's not going to be enough. <laughs> not going to be enough. You're very close to that cliff. Yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry. <laughs> Hello, Mitzi. How you doing? Welcome in. Welcome in. You an ARC fan? Uh, make sure to leave room for a train station area so Jimmy can pick you up. <laughs> oh, don't worry. There is so much room around us. Don't worry. <laughs> Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so we have 11 more. Let's see how close that puts us to being done with this pin. Do, 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 do. Ooh. You know what? No, I'm going to walk on the fine line. I'm going to walk on the edge of the cliff just to make y'all a little, a little nervous. We're going to play the nervous game. Y'all know about that game? If I fall, I'm gonna be a little sad, <laughs> but I don't think I will. Ooh, this is the narrowest part. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> ah, we're missing some. Okay, so we need one, two, three. Three more to complete our pin. So let's start chopping again and grinding for this wood. Then we'll be done. <laughs> Um, so you might want to make your shack out of adobe so you don't overheat in your own place. Yeah, we haven't gotten there yet. We we get wood for now. In the next episode, or maybe the episode afterwards, we'll get uh, adobe. I still gotta learn about the game a little bit. And right now, I know wood. <laughs> but yeah, I know about uh, the whole overheating and adobe thing. I just don't know how to make adobe. I forgot what y'all said already. You said put a... Uh, Sand and something in the mortar and pestle to make clay. And clay is used for adobe, right? I think that's what was said. Save all your sand. I've been trying to um, until I die, inevitably, by a raptor. 
And your cactus? What do you need the cactus for? Is that for the adobe? <laughs> I do want to look up what tames are on this map. And I'm pretty sure I can find that in the, uh, the arc wiki, right? Oddly, we haven't had heat waves. How do you know when there's a heat wave going? What's it look like? Or does it look like anything? Also, we have some points to put into our person, so... Let's go with... Tiny bit more health. And y'all know I'm a pack rat, so I'm just gonna go ahead and put all these points into weight. <laughs> we're gonna need... We're gonna need it regardless, so I'm doing it now, okay? <laughs> um... Sand and sand and oh, cactus make a uh, clay for adobe. Okay, I've been eating my cactus for water, but thankfully this is a desert map and there's tons of cacti. <laughs> Let's see, where is that wall at? Thirty-two. You know what? We'll need it regardless. One day we'll go ahead and make it. Uh, when there's a heat wave, you have a chance to find the phoenix. Is the phoenix like the unicorn, where there's only, like, one or two per server? I think I heard that somewhere, but I could be, like, horribly wrong. What's the rare thing on this, uh, on this server? Is it the phoenix? I'm excited for weverins. Are y'all excited for weverins? That's gonna be great. <laughs> That's, like, one of my favorite tames. The phoenixes? Ooh... Ooh, I wonder who on the server is going to find the phoenix. Again, guys, if you want to join the server, you got to be a super freak tier or above uh, on the channel. Join the Discord, and that's where you get the access information. This is day one, brand new release of the Scorched Earth server. The pretty little Scorched Earth server, so join it now. It's the best time to do it. <laughs> I hope I see a lot of people on there. I know uh, we have a bunch of people super excited to get on there tonight. We are releasing the server to the general member public <laughs> um, as soon as the stream ends. So that's going to be exciting. I can't wait to watch all y'all village of little huts and stuff. <laughs> Low wyverns? It's wevern. Why'd you, why you got to correct me, sir? There we go. I might have to jump on BC. I'm, I liked watching Jimmer play. Jimmer was able to stream his screen since he has a PC as well. Um, and it was pretty fun seeing him run around <laughs> having all the trouble that I've been having. And if y'all were concerned, this is cross-platform. So you could have PlayStation. You could have Xbox. You can have a Nintendo if Ark is on Nintendo and play on the server. I don't think Ark is on Nintendo, though. I don't think so. <laughs> but yeah, it's a whole cross-platform server. So everyone can join. But there we go. Our pit. Our little dino pit. He is safe. Um, He's safe from land animals. I haven't seen many. Oh, my God. I haven't seen many flyers over here, so he should be fine. He should be. It is on Nintendo. Oh, that's cool to hear. Says the guy with the Mario profile picture. <laughs> that's Mario, right? The profile pictures are so tiny. <laughs> that's, that's funny. There's one flyer. What is this moth, dude? Mothman. Oh, this is a high level moth. How do you get these moths? He pretty cute. I heard you can ride on them, but they're a little difficult to get. Maybe we'll get that in the next episode. ASC is on Nintendo, not ASA. <gasps> oh, no. It's Mario rolling a J. <laughs> That's a great profile picture. I love it. It's amazing. So if you have a shovel, you can shovel any ground and water pops up. So you, so you can just spam it. Oh. That's cool. I don't know if you saw Jolts, but uh, we have this amazing little pit over here. We built our house by this water vein by accident. 
and I'm really glad for it. Someone told me about putting a well on top of it, but I'm, I don't really know what wells do. I don't think we've used a well before. I don't know. <laughs> safe from dinos, they can't hurt wood, so a little safe. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. It's safe from all the gerboas, don't you know? But there we go. We got ourselves a house. Let me... Is there a better lighting? I need better lighting. Can I stick my head? Right, that's horrible. That is that is terrible. Y'all will have to deal with this for now. So let's do a little recap of the stream. We started off on the island. We did the little beauty pageant concert. Very fun. Very awesome. Go watch that in the beginning of the stream if you missed it. It was great. Um, then we went over to Scorched Earth. Died 10 times. Started on a thatch hut. Um... It was a bad hut. We'd even have a door. And now we have this. And we have a parasaur. And we have a jerboa. And a bunch of materials. We're going to go ahead and stop here. I think we made a lot of progress. We've been streaming for three hours and a half. Did a lot of good work. And um, this, has been, this has been one of my favorite streams that we've done in a while. I had a lot of fun. And I hope you guys did too. If you did, make sure you smash that like button. If you haven't subscribed yet, consider doing that if you enjoyed yourself. But uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and leave it off here. I'll read the rest of the comments while I'm ending stream. I appreciate all y'all's tips and tricks. Y'all are amazing. I appreciate y'all's time. But I will see you guys on Monday for yet another amazing stream. Enjoy the rest of your day, morning, evening, whatever time it is for you guys. Enjoy your, re your weekend. Be safe. Be very safe, but have fun. Bye, friends.